everyone, and welcome to Samsung's annual Hope for Children charity gala. I'm Cheryl Lazar, joined by the amazing Michael Buckley at Buck Hollywood. Uh, thank you. Welcome I to know. you, too. This is the first time we've ever done anything together. We've never. We've just been friends forever. We've threatened, we've practiced, we've tried. We've retweeted, it's we've done a lot, ton of social media. Never YouTube. worked out. Never. I've been on your show a couple times as a guest. Yes. But we've never stood here together to co-host, and right before we started, she'd tap my leg like, I'll start. And I was gonna, I was gonna, <laughs> he I was, knew. He knew. I was gonna jump in front of her and be like, hi, I'm Michael Buckley. <laughs> and this well, is what's trending. Oh, you yeah. can own it anyway, even without me. We're actually in New York City at Cipriani Wall Street. This is where it all goes down. This is our third year being part of this big event. And just to give people a little bit of information about what we're actually doing here, Hope for Children is part of Samsung's initiative, which really helps children lead lead healthier, smarter, more sustainable lives. They b donate money every single year to over 750 charities, all helping children around the world. And a lot of the celebrities you're gonna see and talk to tonight using the hashtag hope the number four children are really here to represent their charities and tell us more about them. And so today's all about social giving, social good, and us creating, you know, all, all that good stuff and a movement around that using the hashtag hope the number four children. Uh, we actually have our whole social uh, TV here with tag board. Hashtag hope the number four children. As you can see, the tweets, the Instagram photos are coming in right now. If you tweet with the hashtag hope the number four children, if you Instagram take a picture, whatever, you will appear on this incredible Samsung TV right now. And we're going to be also giving you guys, whoever tweets, a shout out on air and also with your favorite celebrities. So there's a lot of giving happening here tonight. There's a lot of giving and there's a lot of celebrities. I, I, there are. Who are you excited to see tonight? Well, Carrie Underwood, she follows me on Twitter. She we're Twitter, does. We're Twitter friends, so I hope, and she, I even tweeted her, can't wait to see you, and she said, I'll be on the lookout for no you. No way, really? She did. So I might just push you out of the way and be like, hey. Hey, girl. Um, and I know Olympic skating champion Sarah Hughes is here, and we've been friends for years because I'm a figure skater. Which so. I was always surprised about. And, is there, and, um, and who else is here? Sherry Shepard, who I watch every day on The View. Yeah, Bill Rancic. And Bill Rancic actually co-hosted The View with Sherry today, so I saw him, so that I, we can ask him how it was to co-host. Look at that. You're so uh, newsworthy. Well, I watch The View every day. I don't you know if do that's newsworthy. Still? Wow. I deleted it from my season pass and I recently re-added it. No offense to Barbara. And we also have Jessica Alba who's going to be joining us. Who follows me on Twitter too. And what? that's the best. Why does everyone follow be you? Because I think when you sign no, up I'm for Twitter surprised. back in the day that they suggest you. So both her husband Cash and she follow me. And I swear to God if I looked at her right now and said, oh hi, you know you follow me on Twitter. She'd be like, who's this? No idea. Never seen him. No. She probably doesn't look at her Twitter as much as we'd like her to. We also have Neil deGrasse Tyson who's an internet f favorite who's going to be joining us. Yeah. A lot of New York Giants because we are New York. Yeah. So we have a lot of New York uh, athletes representing here tonight. And I nicely text Shira before the event and I said if it's a sports person, it's all you. I'll do my best. But oh, they're just people. They're just people, but like. Uh, and they also, uh, they converge with the world of pop culture. I know you talk we can a lot talk, about Right, and charity and stuff, but I mean, you've got some like sport, like, oh, the Super Bowl. And I'm like. The Super Bowl? Don't I, what, what does that or mean? The NFL, the, yeah. And Sean Avery's here with his girlfriend, and Sean Avery, who I always, and he got voted off Dancing with the Stars. Oh, we, so you know a lot about that. We probably, we probably but he would, I think of him more as a celebrity pop culture friend of Andy Cohen rather than a sports person, because I feel like he was not doing sports by the time I became. And there's Shira. This is awesome. So this so is our So please send us a picture board. of yourself with no makeup on. <laughs> no. Hashtag hope it the number four. It was a vine that evolved from children. no makeup to makeup, I'm hearing a lot of excuses. Scary. I'm hearing a lot no of excuses. I have no shame. I show it all. So please post your picture. Oh, there's Sherry Shepard. Effort is tweeted Very with nice. my hashtag hope for children and that's also what we want to ask all of you and we'll, we will be bringing yeah. up uh, the most amazing inspiring tweets what is your hope for children let us know tweet with the hashtag hope for children and a lot of people have thoughts because I think we're all thinking about like what what the future holds there's so much happening this day and age with technology you know the private sector the public sector you know, even with LeVar Burton with his Kickstarter campaign, Amazing. raising over $3 million for Reading Rainbow. Amazing. People on the, in private areas are starting to get more involved. It's not just, you know, the public sector and the government. People, innovators, entrepreneurs are really building new programs to help the future for all of us. And there was another school shooting today, so my hope off the top right, of my head right now is yeah. no more school shootings. Yeah, let's not let's not talk about sad things. I, I didn't bring it down. No, you didn't. Uh, but let's bring it up now uh, with a little highlight of what went down at the Hope for Children Gala last year, so you have a sense of what this is all about and how exciting this evening is going to be.
Uh, we're here today to celebrate Samsung's 12th annual Samsung Hope for Children Gala. This remarkable program has raised more than $30 million over the years for more than 300 schools, community-based foundations, and nonprofits. We have raised $1.5 million to further our cause. I'd like to talk about this great company. This is the best company because they're helping the children of America. We started went with one school and now we have 17 schools. The fact that Samsung is doing the same thing on a much higher and greater level than we, we are as individual citizens is unbelievable. It's the best thing, it's the most wholesome thing that any corporation could ever do for the world. As a girl who loves science, and as a woman who deeply believes in the future of our country and that we need every kid to grow up and live his or her dreams, I'm really grateful to Samsung. STEM is fundamentally about the future. You know, it is incumbent on all of us to invest in ensuring that they have the skills that they need to help create a world that is more healthy, more equitable, and more interesting for all of us. I want to thank everyone at Samsung. We've been working together for a few years now, and uh, Mr. Kim, Mr. Baxter, and all the team from Samsung, we appreciate all the support that you've given us. The single best way we can change that to help break that cycle of poverty is to make sure that all of our kids have an opportunity to get a quality education no matter what neighborhood they live in. And that's why I founded the Show Me Campaign, because we wanted to do something about it. We wanted to fight for these kids. We wanted to be a voice for these kids. We wanted to partner with organizations that are doing the right thing. to the Samsung Hope for Children Charity Gala Blue Carpet. Once again, Cheryl Lazar here with Michael Buckley, the amazing. All these adjectives yes. don't live up to the <laughs> billing. I'm adequate. <laughs> don't have too many expectations, kids. No, raise your expectations, raise the bar. We are encouraging you, you all to tweet with the hashtag hope the number four children. We're gonna be giving shout outs live on this live stream tonight. And also any questions you have for celebrities who will be joining us like Carrie Underwood, your Susan Sarandon might even be joining I love us. Her. I saw that on the tip I wanna sheet. go to her ping pong establishment. Oh yeah, I heard about that. It was a lot of fun. Also some of the stars from Orange is the New Black. Which is so I mean, I everyone's obsessed with season. that show. Uh, and we, of course, are provided this amazing tag board that is bringing up your tweets in real time. So you might even show up on air in back of us. That's how we do it here. So let's start giving a, a few shout outs, shall we? Well, Lily, Lily wrote, my hope for children is for all children to have access to an education. And Lily, it's her birthday. Happy birthday, Lily. How do you know? Because Lily retweets my videos every day. Oh, so that's Lily, nice. Lily is a very good What the Buck I supporter. I love it. So thanks, Lily. Happy uh, birthday. This one is from at Hannah. Uh, Nagel22, my hashtag hope the number four children is that they will be able to have a building education, which is really goes back to, you know, access for all yep. and uh, the best education we can we can give the future. Uh, this also, uh, Lily also tweeted again. Oh, Susan Sarandon did tweet. Oh, what'd she write? She goes, very excited to present award to at Malala at Samsung hashtag hope for children tonight. Big thanks to Samsung tweets for the donation to Hope North. So basically what happens, a ton of celebrities are here. They're here to talk about their charities. Um, and also because Samsung does donate millions of dollars every year through Hope for Children to children's initiatives, which a lot of these celebrities are representing. A lot of them have their own charities, like Carrie Underwood. Right. And so I'm sure she'll be talking about what she's up to So the stars well. really want to get retweets tonight to spread the word about their charity. Yeah, and that's what I, I love about this. We have, shout out to our friends at Nerdist.com, oh, hey. who uh, let their following and fans know about the live stream tonight. And of course, Comedy Gives Back, which has yearly 24 hour live stream, which we're a part of. Yeah. And so all the people that love giving back are showing support tonight. So thank you so much. Geek and Sundry too, you know Felicia Day? I do, she tweeted me today because I posted a picture of that um, creepy toaster strudel guy and she thought it was a joke and surely it was not real. It's real Felicia Day and it's creepy. Wow. Hopefully they're not a sponsor here I didn't here see, tonight. no. Toaster strudel, that commercial, Yeah. it's disturbing. You're lucky you're from Canada, you don't have to put up with this. No, I know I live in the States. I don't. So. And it's <laughs> local and you know, everything is shared around the world even if you're not, you know, I'm in kidding. one place. It was hilarious in my brain. All right, so. Part of the, uh, the Hope for Children is Samsung uh, wants to solve 
for Tomorrow initiative. This is an initiative uh, Samsung really likes to bring to everyone. It's called Solve for Tomorrow. You can check it out, I'm sure, online. But this is more about it. Right now we're going to roll this video clip, uh, so check it out. And tweet with the hashtag, hope the number four children. We want to give you a shout out live on air. This is the fourth year of Solve for Tomorrow as a nationwide program for science, technology, engineering and math education. And uh, we had the idea of having the final award ceremony for this program here in the nation's capital. It's a chance for the teachers, students, principals to come here to talk about STEM education. Companies like Samsung going out of their way to not just put money in schools and honor the work of students and school districts is hugely important. And we find in the federal government that those public-private partnerships, they're the ball game. Samsung has the experience. It's got the, the ideas about what we need for the future. And to have that level of engagement makes so much of a difference. Often many of the schools are struggling to find the resources for Samsung to come in and provide these resources will make a tremendous impact on the schools. Science, technology, engineering, and math, and wanting them to continue their education in that area. You know, this is taking uh, a real-world problem and coming up with a real-world solution uh, to make a difference, and that's what, what this is all about, making a difference in people's lives. What we'd like to do now is really celebrate the five grand prize winning schools. For kids, you don't have to no longer convince them that this is important, that math and science is relatable and they see it for themselves. It's a game changer for our school. These kids will have the world at their fingertips now. I'm really excited to see what we can do. The fact that we earn this much money feels great because now we know that the students who are younger than us are able to do whatever they need to do with whatever they need. It's definitely a unique experience. I've never really been inside of the White House and inside of and in the meetings. I am very impressed with the Samsung team. Everybody I've met there really care about science education and, and this is what we need. You know, that partnership with private in business and, and public education. It's just an honor to be able to come to Washington DC and finally just thank all of the people who have given us these funds and meet the people behind what has helped us learn. These kids are truly amazing. Just understanding the, the scope of the different projects that, that they took on is it, truly fascinating and inspiring. Confidence, curiosity, a mastering of the core subjects in your school to create things, that's what allowed the greatest innovators the world has ever known to cure diseases, connect the country, light up the night sky, and peer into far depths of the universe that we haven't even seen before with our own eyes. And today, we actually add you to that list. Your persistence to take risks on ideas, that's the currency of innovation. That's what not only solves problems of tomorrow, but if you build on those ideas, if you share and experiment, you're really going to be able to reshape the world. Without Samsung being involved and providing us with this opportunity, um, none of this would have been possible. Um, I'd like to see more companies step up to the plate and support students. For Samsung to be able to provide these kind of dollars and these kind of programs, um, it enables our young people to do things they couldn't have done before. Thank you at Samsung for investing in education, investing in the future of America. What a great initiative that is. Samsung donates all that money to schools. Um, so that's what it's really all about here tonight, supporting the future, education, children of tomorrow and today, and really allowing them and empowering them to have a bright, sustainable future. And of course, we want to hear your thoughts. What is your hashtag? Hope, the number four children. We're giving shout outs live on air throughout the night and also, also asking uh, your questions to your favorite celebrities here on the blue carpet using the hashtag Hope, the number four children. Who are you excited to talk to? You talk to celebrities way often more than I do. Is there anybody I, you're interested to see? I love Susan Sarandon. Yeah. I really do. I've interviewed her before and she's so thoughtful and so cool. And you forget, you know, she's been in so much. Yeah. But she's like just a do regular you ever person. Oh, uh, so I actually, yeah, that's I can't back. even deal with it. I, can't, I have to leave the show. Is my favorite. Oh well, that's way back. That's, that's okay. really that's way back. School. That's really uh, way back. I think Shepard's always fun uh, to see. I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. And who else? It's funny. Last 
year Robin Thicke performed. And it was before the whole song yeah, blew up. Yeah. And so he performed here in front of everyone. And you know, usually obviously it's like tween girls are his audience. Yeah, like yeah, tween yeah. girls and these are all adults obviously who loved him and all the women were you know, I can't say the men. The men were like, Okay. Yeah. And obviously the women loved it. And if I saw Robin Thicke well, a year would ago, freak out. I wouldn't freak out. I would have gone and I would have said, Oh my god, your father is Alan Thicke. Tell me of growing pain stories. Like I could care like, less. Let's get down to business. Seriously. Growing pain stories. What was Leonardo DiCaprio like that last season when he was on Growing Pains? You want to know the real I love how Lee Leonardo DiCaprio DiCaprio won't film with Keeping Up with the Kardashians because he was like on Growing Pains and that's like his TV cred. Hashtag whatever. So hope for children. <laughs> we're uh, giving shout outs to people who tweet the hashtag hope the number four children. Also tag board with some live tweets coming up right now from everyone around the web including uh, a lot of the guests who are joining us tonight. Amanda Rose, thank you so much. Actually she founded Twestival which is a Twitter charity oh, festival. Oh that's cool. Uh, I know so Amanda, yeah. She's saying uh, a lot of great things. It's great to see so many people supporting hashtag hope the number four children. And and That's course, funny. Sarah Hughes agree. tweeted and asked what shoes she should wear, and I said the silver strappy sandals. So let's see if she shows up in those red now shoes. Now you know. She will be wearing a silver sequiny flappy dress. That is what her Instagram has predicted. Oh, really? Yes. Very nice. So, and she said, what shoes should I wear? And I thought I should chime in because, you know, people because like that's me what tend you to do. be good at those things. Also, Tim Morehouse. I know Tim Morehouse. So it's hilarious. Tim Morehouse is an Olympic silver medalist fencer who I competed against in celebrity skate a year ago. You June competed 8th. against I did. We both skated, and I am kind of a skater. He was not. He skated like in hockey skates, and it was like a brutal pummeling. So I destroyed him. So I can't wait for him to come wow, out. Wow, you need a. I'm gonna smack give talk it back him. To him. Tim Morehouse. Now what? Remember a year ago? <laughs> now what? He was like wow. doing shoot the duck. You are intense. I shot his duck. This is intense, Shira. This is toned down so, three notches for Samsung. <laughs> at Jackie H90 says, is there a particular charity Carrie Underwood is supporting? Uh, yes, we will give you more on that charity uh, right after this video that we're going to be throwing to. So keep on watching. Another one from Hannah, uh, who actually has a question for Carrie Underwood. So if you have a question for anyone, by the way, who are mentioning here on this live stream, uh, tweet your questions also with the hashtag Hope the Number Four Children. We want to spread the word throughout the Twitterverse tonight. Yeah. Hopefully get it trending because be we have great. so many great people here today and I love getting something trending that's for a good cause. Right. So when you see it on the trending list, you're like, oh, what is that for? Like, oh, the future and education for children. That's pretty awesome. Thank right. you. It's adorable that you got your favorite celebrity to a million followers, but what good did that do the world? Yeah. All right, well, uh, let's start with this clip. Samsung had a huge event at South by Southwest to announce the winner of Solve for Tomorrow. So let's take a look at that right now. We're here at South by Southwest EDU today with the national finalists of the Samsung Solve for Tomorrow competition. The schools are here today to present their project in front of a panel of judges. This is the final step in becoming a national winner. This program speaks very strongly of Samsung. They've created a program for students that's valuable to them. They've given them a platform to share their ideas and their work. And they've really highlighted the importance of STEM education and the ways in which students can learn about STEM and apply it to solve problems within their communities. Well, you know, I, I certainly applaud Samsung uh, as being a great corporate citizen. And a lot of companies talk a good game, uh, but Samsung's actually walking the walk. And, you know, they're saying, hey, we want to help future of tomorrow. We want to help inspire them, uh, get them to leave their comfort zone and give them the confidence that they need to go through life. And that's what this program is. This is a once in a lifetime opportunity for my students to be here. Most of them have never experienced anything outside of their own neighborhoods. I think it's cool to be here as a national finalist for the Samsung contest because I've never been to Texas before and it's also great to meet other students around the country who are interested in the STEM fields and trying to find ways to help improve our world. Without efforts like Samsung beyond the corporate responsibilities, we wouldn't be as great a nation as we are today. When I first did this project, I had no idea it was going to be this big of a deal. I'm just, it's so amazing to be here and like I'm representing my school and it feels really good. Everyone's supporting me and it's really fun to be here. I've never been to Texas. <laughs> What they're doing through Software Tomorrow is huge. It's going to have a significant impact. Uh, it's not just about the contest. Uh, sure, teams will win prizes, but at the end of the day, we're growing leaders, and Samsung is, is helping to do that. We're also fostering creative thinking. Uh, all of those things will help make our students much more competitive, and in the end, really have a tremendous impact on our, our society. 
course, all went down at South by Southwest in Austin, Texas. Have you been? I, I was just going to ask. No, I've never been. Wow, I was invited a couple years there. ago. I'll go. I'll go. I'd love to go with what's trending. Uh, yeah, we've been there years. I mean, I've been there personally I for watch. six years. Yeah. We've been there with Samsung for the past three years, doing amazing things, having the biggest celebrities um, at the festival stop by the Blogger Lounge. Uh, that's, of course, on YouTube.com slash what's trending. So we have a, we have loved doing those types of events, and that's also what brings us here because it's not just about entertainment and just always having fun, but it's also about using media to give back. So that's why initiatives like this are really important uh, to what's trending and me personally to be involved with. And I know you too. It's like I do. I just got back from South stuff. Africa for a charitable trip. So, uh, yeah, I yeah. love it. And, and so Hope for Children, that's why we're here to really support the future of, of children's education, sustainability. And if you tweet the hashtag Hope the Number Four Children, that's really it's so easy how you can support the cause and spread the word tonight uh, because, you know, it's all about that domino effect, that word of mouth. Right? Right. And that's I'm how people find tweets. more about it. People. And so we, we, we will be talking about people that tweet. We're going to talk about you. You tweet the hashtag over for children. Only good things. And we'll give you a shout out on air. Yeah. And uh, someone had actually asked us about Carrie Underwood's, Carrie Underwood's charity. charity. And so you were saying, uh, you actually knew about it because she launched it or talked about it on Idol, right? Well, I just remember that was her hometown, Chicota. Yeah. I can't even say her hometown. Chicota. And so Chikota. I remember just thinking, what an interesting hometown. So her charity is entirely based in yeah, where she's CATS, from. Yeah, it's called Chicota Animal Town and School Foundation. And I actually, you know, looked it up, but she, I'm sure, will talk a bit about it uh, when she comes here. So it's a privately funded. It will help the needs of, and services in the area of Chicota to directly impact the community. And so that's really nice to see you're giving back really locally. Right. What do they say? Uh, think global, act, act local. Local. Can you imagine if I just made that up? I brand, you know, think. You're like really think smart. local. Overheard. Local. Overheard. At <laughs> what's trending? Blue carpet. <laughs> or you yeah. can just pretend that you came up with it. People do that all the time on Twitter. People re write things that I wrote in 2010, and I'm like, really? I wrote that in 2010. You're like, I brought that up. So we're gonna give some shout outs right now on air. Let's see. Thank you, Lily, for keeping watching. Yes. Lily and Hannah. I know we have, okay. Robin. Robin Greenfield, uh, who's tweeting about Jessica Alba. Actually, I think she is retweeting a blog post I did for Huffington Post. So. Very nice. Thank you. We have other questions coming in for Carrie Underwood with the hashtag hope for children. We will keep these questions for when she shows up. And uh, Mike Michael. Duman. Hey, Mike. Hey. Shout out to you. And Tim Morehouse just wrote, see you soon, Buck Hollywood, Hope for Children. It's like he heard me. He wrote, see you soon, really? Buck Did Hollywood. Did you see that? Yeah. Why would I make that up? He was right there. Tim Morehouse, see you soon, wow, Buck Hollywood on the blue carpet. getting shout outs from all the celebrities yep. uh, right here. And so what, what charities do you uh, like supporting that well, the consider big, children? Well, the Thirst Project, because that's what I was in South Africa for. We were down in Swaziland, and we had funded a well last year at VidCon. So That's me great. and two other YouTubers, yeah, Taryn Southern, was Taryn well. Southern yeah. and Ali Speed went down there to get footage of us at the well. So when we go to VidCon this year, we can say, oh my God, you guys, look at this awesome well that you built. And so, and the nice thing about that organization too is most of their donations and funding is from students who started organizations at their school. So if you go to the thirstproject.org and click on send them to our school, the Thirst Project will come to your school and teach the kids how to be interested in providing clean water all over the world. So it's a really cool organization. It's, an, it's a huge issue also. Yeah. We don't realize because we have so nope. many things that are accessible to nope. us, we don't realize how many people don't have that. Nope. And we should have gratitude, obviously, every single day. No. Nope. For things like that. And we went down to the old water source, and it was like there were pigs rolling around, and there was defecation, and this is the, and there were little children pumping the well, uh, not, just scooping it up with buckets, and yeah. that was their water until the Thirst Project built a well there. So it's like, yeah, we take it for granted, and, you know, clean, safe drinking water should be a basic human right, so that's what they're trying to do. That's you know? great. Yeah. And, and we'll be hearing about charities like the ones you mentioned as well as so many more that a lot of these celebrities, some of them have even started. Right. or they're representing here on the blue carpet. And we're actually doing something fun. We're going to be taking selfies yes. on the WT Live Instagram account <laughs> with all our celebrities, which should be fun. And the celebrity that gets the most retweets, like once we tweet it, that retweets it and gets the most shareability out of it, is actually going to get more money donated to their charity of choice. And we really did want to do a, um, uh, all that. We, we really did want to have yeah. the, um, 
someone take the picture for us, and then Shira's like, that's not really a selfie. Yeah, we, so. we will be doing selfies. So we, we actually have Boomer Esiason, who has been here every single year. Uh, I actually, hi. <laughs> Shira, from What's Trending, we hi, actually Shira. interviewed you in your uh, little radio, in your studio. Oh, that's right. Year. You guys came in and said this hello. This is Michael Buckley. Hi. Michael, to nice to see you. Welcome. How are you? We're very Did well. You like your show. You Thank you. You gotta tweet that I will live. tweet, I will. My daughter's tweeting okay, right now. Okay, you gotta more your daughter. Your, 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 yes, not yes, Sydney, my daughter, daughter, yes. You look beautiful. Yeah, you do, beautiful. Sid, you look beautiful. <laughs> uh, she does. So tell us, you, you've been part of um, this incredible event for right. many years. Well, since the beginning. It actually started as uh, Samsung's Four Seasons of Hope. Yeah. There were four of us in four different uh, sports. So hence the four seasons, and it, then it morphed into uh, uh, Hope for Children, and our foundation fights cystic fibrosis. So we deal with the pediatrics, we deal with the adults. My son is now 23 years old, and for 13 years, Samsung has been a big part of the fundraising arm of our foundation. We just passed $100 million last year wow. raised. Uh, Samsung's a good partner in that. It supports us in so many different ways. And the only thing I could tell you, for a small foundation like us, to have a large corporation like Samsung to be a part of it, it gives us a well of credibility and allows us to raise a ton of money. That's amazing. Can it is. Can you tell us some of the, uh, where that money goes? About 50 million has gone into drug development. So there have been five drugs that have come from the test tube to the patient that my son is benefiting from, as well as all uh, other CF uh, patients are benefiting from over the last 20 years. Yeah. We've put uh, $11 million into Columbia Presbyterian here in New York City to create the Gunner Esiason Adult Cystic Fibrosis Wing. We also have the Gunner Esiason Pediatric Wing in Cincinnati Children's Hospital. We also give out over $3 million in scholarship to CF families and we also do lung transplant grants. So we are very active wow. on top of creating all sorts of programs for our CF community that, that people can take part in. That's incredible. Yes, yeah, it so is. It kind of makes you feel like Amazing. not worthy. You're like, <laughs> no, no, you are worthy. You're you very, are worthy. No. Yes, you are. But what is your hope for children that you want to share with everyone? Well, my hope for cystic fibrosis children is that they can live a long and healthy and and, and you know productive life and we want them to be a productive part of society and I think about all the families that went before us that lost children at the tender young age of eight nine ten and even today people losing you know kids in their 20s and 30s uh, way far too early so for me it's all about extending the life but also the productivity and the quality of life for CF children. I see it in my own son, he just graduated from college. And he's out in the workforce, he's becoming a, uh, you know, a normal person uh, in society, all the while fighting the disease of cystic fibrosis, which is a daily regime of about three hours. So um, wow. I'm, I'm amazed by him, I'm amazed by all the things that we've done, and Samsung has been a great partner. Uh, so tell us who you're excited to see tonight. We have, every year there's the same types yes. of people that come. And then yeah, but like Carrie one. Underwood, yeah, that's right. pretty good, right? I'm, at least my daughter says she's supposed to be really great, and, right. I, and I know who she is, of course. You're, you're excited so, to see Shira. You're yes, I know exactly. you're excited to see me. Well, last year it was Robin Thicke, you know? I mean, I read, me and Robin yeah, Thicke were rubbing elbows and this. everything, so that was no, good. You should have taken more pictures, Robin. You're like, should have gotten more things signed. <laughs> yeah, but I know, listen, I knew Robin. Come on, man. You I've do. known Robin for a long time. Wow. Yes, yes. So he doesn't really like, I mean, Listen, we're celebrities, but we're all here for a good reason, right? And we appreciate everything that Samsung has done, and certainly running into Jimmy Johnson year in and year out, and Magic Johnson's been here, President Clinton's been here, yeah. and certainly I've been here for all 13 years, and I, you know, I hope that I don't have to do this for 13 more, but right. if I do, I'm glad that Samsung will have my back. Of course, so we're gonna do a selfie with you. Oh, I love that. You should take it. But I have to do it. Yeah, you need to do it. So does how your this charity works? have a website to tell yes. everyone? Yes, what is that? we are asiasin.org. So Siasin. how this works is you're gonna, gonna take, you're gonna take a selfie of yourself here on the blue carpet. You're competing, mm -hmm. though, oh, against okay, all the other celebrities here right. tonight because we're going to be tweeting it through what's trending with the hashtag Hope for Children. We're going to include your Twitter okay, good. so you'll know when we do. And right. the celebrity that gets the most retweets, we will be giving $5,000 more dollars oh, to your charity tonight. Well, you know, I have about 150,000 followers. Well, so okay, so, so take a selfie. Let's see, my head is so big. <laughs> can you do this? You have to yes, press I the can. I know what I have to press. You sound like my daughter. <laughs> Awesome. Perfect. Thank right, you. That will be going out to the interwebs. Thank you so well, much. Well, thank you so much, guys. Great, great to see you guys again. Thank, thank you for making us a great thank you. Tonight. There you go. That is going up right wow. now on the interwebs. Instagram.com. He's so well spoken. No, he's, he's great. And he really, uh, not only does Samsung support him, uh, but obviously he's been a huge support over the years. And it's crazy because he's so, you know, it's so personal because it's his son, so... Oh, we have a very exciting guest coming up. I, oh my God, Bill, Bill Nye. Nye, the science guy. All right, we want to take your questions now. Hashtag hope the number four children.
Oh, <laughs> it's been years. Nice to see you. This is Michael Buckley. Hi, nice to meet you, big fan. Should you fan. tweet that you're live? Come on, you need to come tweet on. That you're live. You could join us. So right now, tweet your questions. Hashtag Hope for Children for Bill Nye. Yes. How's it going? Don't have a clue. Am I holding this? Yes, Why? this is your mic. How, you how is it works. going? Yeah, yeah, exactly. This is not, broadcasting isn't something new for you. No, it's not new for me. And you? Um, <laughs> you I'm, I'm learning every day. Yeah, we all you know, do. So, always a, a so what do we need it's to cover here? Well, tell us about being here and your charity that you're representing. Uh, you're well, the, the charity we're representing is the Planetary Society, the world's largest non-governmental space interest organization advancing space exploration for the betterment of humankind. Yes. So it is my claim, uh, which is not an extraordinary claim, if we invested more in space exploration, especially planetary science, we would not need to run around all day, as we do, saying STEM, 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 STEM for science, technology, engineering, and math. It would just happen. Furthermore, we would make discoveries that would probably change the world. If we were to find evidence of life on another world, mm -hmm. you saw your eyes, yes, you, yes. Oh yeah, when you hear if that, If we were like, to fly what? a spacecraft, very reasonably priced space spacecraft, through the plume of the geysers coming off Europa, the moon of Jupiter, yeah. and we were to discover something alive in there, let me just say, do, 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 trying to do that on Mars right now? Yes, we're trying to do that on Mars. So. We land on Mars one year. It, you can only go to Mars every 26 months yeah, because, be careful with it, right? because, <laughs> yeah. because of what they did with the Earth and Martian orbits. Yes. All right. And so uh, you go to one time and you land a rover. And you go another time and you take a sample. Then you go one more time and you put the sample in orbit around Mars. Then you go again and you bring it back. And that can all be done. But if we were to just go for it, like get her done, we could do all that in one or two missions instead of but four or five. It's also because these the are details. Well, the public sector also doesn't have really the money to support that. So you're, oh, are we relying well, more on so, the private sector? But right now? so here's the thing. Yeah. Well, bear in mind the private sector to talk technically, not to go on and on. Yeah, has we're taken, get deep here. Has wow. taken <laughs> five hundred. <laughs> no, has taken He's five like, hundred. Can you talk about Dancing with the Stars? No, well, you were robbed. <laughs> five five hundred million dollars has gone to just one company yeah. for a commercial crew. That's great. I mean, that bring it on. Uh, but here's the claim. Uh, in 20 years, if we don't have young engineers in the pipeline, the United States will fall farther and farther behind. I know we're working with a Japanese company, but the United States and Samsung will have trouble hiring people. The space program is actually a very reasonable investment in not the short or medium term, in the long term. So thank you for asking. Yeah, well, of course. good that's answer. That's why we're here. We wanted you to be here today because when we were talking about um, getting celebrities to join us on the blue carpet, you're definitely on top of mind. One, because you connect so much with this generation. You continue to, right? Yes, that was, that was, <laughs> I was got a shock from being connected. <laughs> and also because you have your own nonprofit that we wanted to give back. So yes. I wanted to give back to you as well. Thank you. And it's the nonprofit started by Carl Sagan. And uh, if those of you who watched Cosmos last Sunday, uh, or last night on National Geographic, on another station, um, his soliloquy is about the pale blue dot and how we're all alone in the universe. Nobody's coming over here to help us, over the hill to help us, is quite moving. Mm -hmm. And he started this organization, and as you may know, I had Carl Sagan for astronomy, and now I'm here with you. What more could a man hope for? An evolution. <laughs> Being here with Jessica and I, you. Yeah, your lovely day. Do you want to say hi to everyone here? You're just, I love how we, we gave you a mic. We wanted yeah, you to chat. Yeah, really nice. <laughs> Ready for that mic. <laughs> but that's, we like sharing the love here. Okay. Speaking of which, Neil deGrasse Tyson is going to be here tonight. Oh, good. Do you know your buddy? My, we are, Neil and I hang quite a bit. Isn't that funny? You're kind of, I mean, you're both like representative of like, of the voice of science for the, inter for I guess the world at large, the mainstream That's audience. us, yes. Is that what you, that's that's right. what you yes. feel, right? Science is for everyone. You don't have to get an advanced degree in physics, as some people do. Uh, uh, what do you think the most controversial thing has hap that's happening right now? That oh, climate change is the yeah. biggest problem we all have. And that's, we're not kidding, everybody. Uh, climate change is very serious business. It's going to be very serious for people like me. But for younger people, it's going to be extraordinarily serious business. And keep in mind, if you want to be racked with guilt, this is a great opportunity. People whine and complain about what's going on overseas in Asia and uh, South and um, Southern Asia, uh, India and China. But the United States has been putting carbon dioxide in the air for two and a half centuries. We've already stacked the deck against everybody. Mm -hmm. So the sooner we get going, come up with new energy technology, and especially 
a new energy storage technology. If we could store electricity in, on very large scales, it would, dare I say it, change the world. What? Wow, it sounds oh my somewhat God. evil. No, oh my God. no here's why, not, well, here's I, know, why I, I mention it. Somebody's going to get rich. Don't you want that person to be in the United States, even if you're Samsung? Well, if they're going to get rich, why don't <laughs> companies want to support that? Well, we have a problem here in the United States that's unique. Yeah. We have this very large uh, government that depends a great deal on technology, uh, the, everything that we use here, yet we have a bunch of people who are politically influential who are in denial about this problem. And this is trouble for everybody. I know you got into an argument with someone recently on TV about that. We covered it. Oh, well, an argument, but that's her. They that's just, our business. I mean, you, your business is to get the message out there. Yeah, but it raised awareness, right? I mean, she's... So you like going viral, even if it's controversial, right? Well, sure. Yeah, yeah. I mean, bring it on. Uh, I mean, uh, the idea is to raise awareness of climate change for the betterment of humankind. Mm -hmm. We're not messing around. It's not, this is not something I believe in for the sake of believing in it. This is, I grew up with uh, Earth Day, and now uh, I, Carl Sagan, as you may know, published a paper about this in the 1980s. Mm -hmm. And uh, climate change is a more serious problem than ever. There well, I hate to cut you off. We yeah. actually have to well, go. Well, thank you so much. We did. And we're we're also, uh, oh, let's, we actually need to do a selfie with you. All right, this is how okay. it works, okay, Bill? Yeah. We're taking I'm a selfie with you. We're years. going to tweet it. Through yeah. what's trending, with, and we'll tweet. We you. love the what's trending. And then, retweet, retweet. You want once, to if you retweet it, the, the celebrity that gets the most retweets tonight, we're donating five thousand dollars more to their charity. Whoa! So you better retweet. Wow! Them. Wow! Wow! All I right, let's go, everyone, and you can come in. Hey, honey, hold it higher, girlfriend. All right, we need and to get the tip it down. Oh my! I'm getting taught how to yeah. take. All right. Oh shoot! Yeah. One. Normally two, we tip it sideways. Three. Awesome. Can we do it again, tip sideways? Oh, sideways. Girlfriend? Well, that's how it won't come up on Instagram. Oh, he's doing it. There you go. This is going on. <laughs> you just be in it. I know. Huh? How hard can it be? All right. Hey. Don't forget, look at the lens, not yourself. I know. Thank you. That's why he's the smart one. <laughs> he's doing, he's doing everyone's job all for us. Memory. Oh. You're gonna, he took like 10 pictures. Thank no. you, Bill. Love you, Bill. Nice Remember to do you. the Have hashtag Hope the number four children. All of these celebrities. Thank you thank so you, much. Thank you, Bill. Will wow. be joining, he will be I joining felt us like here. So, I learned so much. He did. Uh, if you tweet us right now, Here's we're going to Tim Morehouse. I've been waiting for this all night. I saw your tweet. I know. Tim, take a microphone. I got it. How are you? Good to see you. Hi, I'm Michael. actually made it because I'm being interviewed by Michael Buck. Oh, oh I so that. I told them about a year ago we had Celebrity Skate. How was that for you? That must have um, been. Are you just trying to hide the fact that you won? And first place, you had first place, skate? first place. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so Tim, uh, fencing, oh my god, how's it going? And you have a, you, you're, I want to say, it's great, we're going you skating. Want, you don't want to talk about skating? We'll go the whole no, thing. I, I beat you, but we, it was good, it was for a fun night, right? It was for a have, great cause, just like tonight, raising money for, uh, you know, doing great things. So, uh, so yeah, tell you us did, about you did your, defeat me in figure skating, but well, we still have a fencing rematch coming up. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. Uh, so tell us about the charity you're supporting here tonight. We we'll actually have a foundation called Fencing in the Schools that uh, Samsung is supporting tonight. We have 10,000 kids fencing across the country, a lot of uh, inner city and rural areas where kids might not normally have the opportunity to fence. And we're all about fighting childhood obesity and providing great role models for kids. We bring Olympians to talk to the kids, and we wouldn't be able to do our thing without you know corporate support like Samsung. That's great. Who are you excited to see tonight? Everyone. This is like one of my favorite nights on the calendar. And oh, yeah. the two of you, first of all. Thank you. Uh, I, was, I, was on, I was on Twitter on my way here like, oh, okay, I'm ready for you guys. Um, but no, I mean, uh, Tony Bennett. Like, right. Is there, is there a greater... Uh, you know, gentlemen around than him. So, and lots of great sports stars. So, we're really excited. Right. And my wife is in Vera oh, Wang you look, tonight. You look beautiful. Looking beautiful, Vera most Wang. importantly. And uh, we want to give some shout outs to people who are tweeting us to, today awesome. with the hashtag Hope the Number Four Children. Want to give those folks some uh, shout outs? Who are we shouting out? This person. Trey Smith, right here. Trey Smith. Thank Trey you Smith. so much. How's it going? You're getting a shout out from New York City Olympic silver medalist Tim Morehouse. Whoa. Whoa. Right here. You better Samsung caption that and send that to your friends. And third place in celebrity and skate. And third place in celebrity <laughs> skate. Fencing's my sport. And Brooke Schuyler. There you go. I apologize for the names. Jackie, we don't know your last name, but it's uh, hey, Jackie. Jackie90. How are you? <laughs> and Hannah. I'm lucky Hannah. Yeah. And, 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 and Lily Ann, oh, OCC. There and what's trending? Uh, what's trending? What's going on right trending? now? 
Yeah, thank you. Oh, and I, I'm going to retweet that as soon as I you see You should it. retweet it. There you go. Well, we appreciate your support and coming out here tonight, and, and congratulations on your foundation. No problem. And yeah. can we just complete the evening by getting a selfie with all yeah. of us? Oh, yes, 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 you got well, it. Well, we're actually taking, and I'm going to take you, a selfie, and I need I to be take a selfie posting too? these. Uh, because Tim, does your site have a, a website that they can find if you're looking for you? Uh, if you want to find me, fencinginthschools.org. Fencing or just org. if you shout fencing five times, yeah. I will fencing, appear. Fencing, 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 fencing. It worked. Here he All is. Right. <laughs> All right, so you're going to... I guess you'll take a selfie. All right. Oh, wait, that was... Oh, oh that was terrible. Oh, wait, that's not us. Hold on. <laughs> this is what happens to you. Check people savvy are, people. Are yeah. Like, great content, right, selfie content. Yay. Go. Wait, almost everyone in. Wait, look at that. Uh, oh, you need to say that one. Or that was awesome. You, you need to say... All right, so this yeah, one's going to be going to the What's Trending account. Oh, and uh, this one will be retweeted, and the, and the celebrity that gets I'm the most off. retweets, $5,000 yeah, to your me. celebrity. <laughs> to your charity. Cute. Great, perfect. Right. Thank you Wait, so what was much. $5,000? More. If yeah. you retweet it, and the most retweets today. I need everyone to retweet Tim Morehouse in a second. Well, you when need I a, yeah, when you retweet it. All right, thank you guys so much. Right now. We'll turn it over to wonderful Jill Martin. Oh, thank okay. you, Tim. Here you go. MSG Today Show. We got we got her all in here. Hi, Jill. Welcome to the blue carpet. Hi, Michael. I love your bracelets. You're beautiful. Wait, I have to do something crazy to get retweets. Oh yeah. Well, you need to do a crazy selfie. You got right. You should take a selfie right now, actually. And we'll be. Then then after I need to give it to my social representative here so I can start tweeting them. The people watching at home are like, can you talk to us? Why are you taking pictures so much? There you Cute. go. So many selfies, so little time. And I'm going to pass this over to uh, someone right now. And you guys what chat. charity are you here supporting this tonight? This is a very cool situation going right, on here. Right, right. We're not so overwhelmed. Eating. Right. So um, what brings you here tonight? Well, I'm so grateful because my brother has a charity that my family's very involved with called Kid Care. And what we do is we support children who are either sick, um, homeless we team up with homes for the homeless nice. um, aren't going to school and we're using this money the five thousand yep. dollars towards scholarship funds for those children Very so I'm nice. super grateful to be here Samsung has always been amazing to me and um, and it really just is a perfect fit yeah so what is the organization website can people find it if they look it up on the internet tell everyone at home yeah. kidcare-org kidcare-org so check that out dot .org, .org. Dot, oh dash org dot com D yeah kidcare-org kid care. yeah kid care nice. uh, google kid care because super grateful and a hundred percent goes um to the children and what is your hope for children we're asking everybody what is your hope for children i mean healthy to yeah. be healthy to be educated um and to be happy you know yeah. we dedicate so much of our time to giving gifts and to giving children things they don't have so this really just is a beautiful thing because it's surrounded by children and you have so many huge names here. I mean, Tony Bennett, Jessica Alba, Carrie Underwood. Um, so it really is everyone comes out and has fun, but it's all for a good cause. Right. Well, thank you so much, Jill. Have a wonderful time. Thanks. If people want to tweet you, what's your Twitter handle? At Jill Martin. But let's do something crazy because if you retweet Woo! me. Top, oh, tops up. Woo! I'm tempted. For $5,000 for uh, God of Charity. Oh, my God. What do you want to do? One drink? One drink? No, I know. <laughs> Did we... Well, it was almost crazy. On that, crazy. Note, On that note, thank you, Thank you so Jill. much. Have fun inside. Have fun. We thank have a ton you. more folks We're joining us tonight. Cool. I just wanted to tweet. We have Mark Herzlick, uh, New York football. New York Oh, Giants. man. The football world. Of course. Hey, but there's a know. microphone for you. So you can tell you. Yeah. No, I'm not. You should. Nothing. You're very wow. dapper. You look great in the Dapper? Suit. <laughs> look how handsome. Yeah, but you should see me dance. It'd be a long we, way. That's the whole point. Let's we do it have... right now. Cheer up. Give me a little best foxtrot. What? Oh, I don't even know how to foxtrot. Well, All right. well. Is this how to foxtrot? Oh, my God. Or is they're going to shut I'm doing like the running man. This is uncomfortable. I like that, though. Tell us about being here tonight and what it means to you. Well, for me, this is, you know, this is, a, first of all, it's a great fun event uh, that we can all come out and really support a good cause. But, you know, one of the biggest things that, um, you know, Samsung Hope for Children does is give children access to the education, uh, to financial support, and to getting the medical treatments that they otherwise wouldn't be able to get. And so for myself being a childhood cancer survivor, that's a big, uh, a big thing for me. So to be able to come out here and really give other people, other kids that hope, it's incredible. Definitely. Uh, tell us about what you're excited about tonight. Well, I'm excited about everything. I'm excited to see the performances. I'm yeah. um, excited to, you know, give away some raffles. Some of my teammates will be here. So Victor Cruz, who uh, he should go on Dancing with the Stars because he can dance very right. well. Uh, so be with the guys and just really spread the good word. Yeah. Are you tweeting with the hashtag Hope 
the number four children. I am okay? just because tweeting. Because we want to get it trending. We want to spread the word because, you know, we're sick of trends on Twitter that have no meaning. We want to bring some meaning to the trends list on Twitter. Like, I just got my blue carpet shot out on Twitter, so nice. hope for children. Oh, you did. Yeah. Yeah, there you yeah, go. Exactly. We're also going to be taking uh, a selfie with you after this. Take a selfie with our, our social media rep right here. And Perfect. we're going to be tweeting out every celebrity here. Celebrity that gets the most retweets from their selfie wins $5,000 more dollars this their Ooh, charity. For their charity? Oh, excellent. Just yeah. saying, it's a heated competition happening right that here. That is big. And I love the woman before you wanted to literally like go topless together. She was like, I need to do something that's going to go viral. So <laughs> very it almost got a little racy. Well, we, we wouldn't, none of us would be uh, in the competition if she did that. So right. That wouldn't be fair to all of us. And, right. and we have uh, a lot more folks coming up on the live stream. We want to remind you, the hashtag is hope, the number four children. Hopefully you know that now if you don't and we're also getting you shout outs live on air uh we're going to be asking questions to your celebrities using that hashtag so please go do it and and spread the word thank you so much yeah, thanks, guys. We appreciate have fun it. Tonight. go take Good your see. selfie thank great you. meeting you, you. Uh, so how's it going was it I fun love, meeting tim i love tim i'm meeting tim i love seeing tim that Jill martin was a stitch oh my god she's very sweet she was so funny we have arena right now joining oh. us as well Hello, nice How to beautiful. meet you and see you. Yes, well, we are live. Welcome. Yeah, welcome. Live. We are live. We are live. Uh, how are you? We're and live. we have to keep the planet alive. Keep so the planet alive. Keep doing these events and gather more people in circle. We yes. need to let more people know about this. Absolutely. Every year there's a ton of great athletes, stars, a lot of local New York celebs, obviously, as well. But you know what's fun? I'm excited for some of the CW stars who are going to be coming to tonight. You know, we got to bring a bit of Hollywood here, too. But you know what? We're all humans. We're all parents. We have children. And this is why we gather tonight to support this event because together we can really do a lot more for our children. Mm -hmm. And what, what charity uh, do you want to talk about tonight that people should know more about? I would like to talk about 350.org, mm -hmm. uh, led by Bill McKibben, with whom I've uh, been collaborating um, against fracking. And, um, the pipeline in Colorado. Um, many other things. I mean, water is really my my my, Your concern my right element. Yes. My element. It's all of us. Within us, 80 percent, 80 percent the uh, water in, in our planet. And uh, um, yeah, coming from Siberia, from Lake Baikal, which is deepest lake in the world, contains 20 percent of fresh water, and it's polluted. That really concerns not only myself not only my family but now the whole world yeah we were talking Absolutely. about that yeah uh, because he just went on uh, a retreat or not going to say a retreat but a trip with a bunch of influencers um to help bring water to like swaziland, yeah, swaziland which we is, built wells yeah, yeah. building you wells know, a lot of people are doing that right now well before you know we will be talking about uh water banks mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 I mean, how many more credit cards do we need? It's true. It's <laughs> and true, how much it's true. how much paper with statements and checks and all these things do we need? It's true. Um, well, uh, talking about the 350.org um, on September 20th and 21st in New York City, it's gonna be the biggest rally uh, that will take place in New York City. So all around anyone, fracking. not only yes, and I'm also very very happy that. Um, uh, Showtime has produced um, the documentary series Years of Living Dangerously. If you have oh, not yeah. seen it, Showtime. please check it out on YouTube or sh w watch it on on, on, um, on Showtime. It's produced by James Cameron and Arnold Schwarzenegger and, and yep. yeah. Awesome. Very nice. Well, it's thank really you so thank you, Irene. Have a no, wonderful my pleasure. night. Thanks. Thank you. And for sharing uh, what, what's on your mind that everyone really should know more about to be more aware, to live more plentiful and healthy lives yeah. this day and age. And, and thanks for what you're doing. Well, you know, it's it's technology, but it's all about harmony. You know, we can we can be friends and, and, and create a harmony in the, uh, with technology and nature. So Thank that's you. Where we are. Have a Thank great you. night. Have a Thank wonderful you. evening. And of course, well, that was fun. Yeah. We, have, we have celebrities lining up waiting to talk to us. I we see. We have the um, star of the Carrie Diaries. Well, I'm so excited because I just, oh, oh, she's going in. Oh, Tony Bennett. Wow. Tony Bennett.
Wow. But this is even so a bigger exciting. surprise. Tony Bennett. Wow. This is what an honor. And Look how handsome you Shira. look. Hi, I'm Michael. Hi. Thank you for being here, Shira. How are you, Tony? Hi, I'm you Michael. Right, Michael. You look beautiful. Hello, Thank Susan. You. Welcome to our, want to come here right our now? blue carpet. Joining us. We are live online. We are live. The whole world is watching. Yeah, and I know you tweet a bunch. I was surprised at how much you tweet, Tony. <laughs> we try. You're, Oh yeah, you do. Yeah. Yeah, 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 are you yeah, yeah. are you amazed at how far we've come, gone with technology this day and age? It's amazing. And What's social happening? media, yeah. Yeah, we get calls from all over the world. Right. Yeah, it's really amazing. And isn't it? What do you think about how it's making us like uncover new musicians and what it's doing to the music world? It means a lot. It actually makes it happen. Right. The public is is in charge. You know? Now, when you were a kid growing up, do you think you would have made videos on YouTube singing? Do you think you would have auditioned for American Idol? Would you have followed the path, or do you would even, you know, what do you think? How do you I think it would have changed? Have. Right. I never have. I do my own thing. Since his own path. Yeah, nice. I just sing quality music at all times. I don't look for any hits. I don't try to get a hit. Yeah. I just sing very intelligent songs. Wow. Because I, I feel the audience deserves that. Yeah. What, what I guess advice do you have for? young up-and-coming musicians this day and age from everything you've been through and, and what you've seen work and, and the legacy you've built well I think it, it should be the the next big thing should be you know they have rap they have you know rock and roll and all that the next big thing is something that's been around a long time it's the only thing that was invented by African Americans in America it's the only creative thing that's ever come out of music in America and that's jazz. Oh. And I think jazz should go and focus all the way. It'll eliminate a lot of bigotry. Wow, really? So you think, not rap, it's jazz is the next big thing. That well, will like it's hopefully hit the mainstream. There. It's always cool. been there, you know, but it, now it's, I think it's gonna go up front. Interesting. With the young this, people. That's why you've heard it here first. I'm doing That's an album trending. with Lady yeah. Gaga. He's predicting. Go. Tony Bennett yeah. predicting that it's trending trend music. Uh, tell us about the charity that you're supporting here tonight and okay. that you want to spread Susan? the message about. Yeah. Well, uh, Samsung has been wonderful supporting our arts education organization called Exploring the Arts. And we started uh, Exploring the Arts in order to create a school in Tony's hometown called Frank Sinatra School of the Arts. And now we support the arts in a total of 17 public high schools in New York City and in Los Angeles. So Samsung has been instrumental in helping us grow our program and will continue to do so. So we're thrilled to be a part of uh, their ph philanthropy. What's your hope for children? And, oh, well, make sure you share it, because I want people to hear it. <laughs> well, we create art programs in all the public schools, and uh, the, the whole premise of art is to search for truth and beauty. Mm -hmm. So when you when you have that happening, it gets a great respect from the rest of the world. Definitely. We're going to do a selfie quickly with you. Is that possible? Can we sure. have the phone for a selfie? This is going to be, I feel like you're going to, I feel I'm like so I excited. With Tony this, is the, this is one of the best moments of my selfie do, life. Do you take selfies? <laughs> well, thank do, you. do you know, uh, selfies, all right, we're going to take a picture right now. No, it's such an I'll, honor I'll show to meet you Tony how Bennett. You meet celebrities, you're like, so oh, selfies so are this. Tony Bennett, for God's sake. People, all right, so selfies, we're going to take it, this. Do it the other way. And do, do, you, do it just to you guys. Do no, it you do it. And then, and if you see it on Twitter, we're going to tweet it. And we'll The celebrity that gets the most uh, landscape. Tonight. Landscape. Five thousand dollars more to their landscape. Gym. Landscape. Right here, are you gonna do landscape. it? Landscape. Oh, no, we can't because it doesn't. Ha oh. It doesn't go up on Instagram. <laughs> Great. Yeah. Thank you so much right. for that. Thank moment. you, Tony. Tony Bennett. Everyone. Have a wonderful night. Thank it's you. Thank you for telling us about your organization. Your organization. That's so it's awesome. We so appreciate, it. and that will be going up on instagramcom live. Oh have a great night. Have a wonderful night. night. Thank you. Fabulous. And it's always great seeing you guys. Thank you. Have fun. Thank you very much. Bye. Thank you, Tony. <laughs> Pleasure meeting you. Thank you. Oh, my God. He's so nice. How do you feel about that? I feel awesome. I mean, seriously, like I said, you know, you meet people and you're like, oh, it's nice to meet you, but it's like Tony Bennett. I mean, right? and he stayed so musically relevant. I don't know if you had in the last CD he put out a couple years ago. It was all collab. Everyone wants to work with him. He sings with everybody. So, I mean, he's just, yeah, that was awesome. Hello. Hi. How are you? That was yeah. Tony Bennett. I know. I looked over and was like, Whoa! I was excited to see you though, and I was like, oh, and they're like, oh, sorry about it, but because I'm a Gossip Girl fan, and I just saw the movie you were in, The Way, Way, 
back. The way, way back. Uh -huh. You need to watch yes. it. It's uh, I watched it twice. It was on the. It was so. Did you love <laughs> He's that like movie? Taking notes and live <laughs> no, did you? No, did you watch? Did you love that movie? Yeah. It's a beautiful, like simple, lovely it's movie. It's a really beautiful. Movie. Anyway, sorry to hijack the interview with. Yeah. No, but we want to talk about things that she's involved with and everything. <laughs> How's it going? It's going great. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, tell us about the charity that you want to talk uh, support tonight, and you want to tell everyone about. Sure. Well, I'm representing True Spark. Mm -hmm. Um, so they bring um character building films to after school programs oh, nice. so it's awesome so like films like rocky or october sky or because of when dixie that was the first movie i was ever in yeah. um and they create curriculum around it and then kids can participate in um in games and just talk about films and sort of like the character traits like generosity or kindness so or cool. loyalty or and stuff like that and really find role models in these films and be able to discuss them and like why they mean something to them. Using the themes of films to empower people. Exactly. Right? Because I feel like media is always looking for like the sexy headline of like a film's like edgy or this that but like mm -hmm. we don't realize how much it can really uh, create you know the rules can bring out really special things in other people. Exactly. Right? Yeah. I think that's awesome. Have you been to this event before? I have not. Were you excited to see or meet tonight? Well, I heard Carrie Underwood yes. is performing. She is. Yes. So I'm We're thrilled. I, I can't wait to see Jesus her. Jesus, take the wheel. Yeah. We, we actually have to go, but it's been wonderful oh, spending time with you. I was going to say, finally, to... what's your hope for children tonight? What's your hope for children? My hope for children is that they would be empowered and believe that they can be the change that they wish to see in the world. I love it. And we're awesome. going to take a selfie with you. Do you okay, mind? Of course. Because we're tweeting. I hate to mention this again, and I want to encourage all of you to tweet it's with your a hashtag. For good cause, though. Help the number four children right now, because we're going to give you shout-outs on air. We're doing selfies, and the celebrity that gets the most retweets, $5,000 more. To, to your charity. charity. So, what? right. So, if you get a, a, so, the more retweets, well, my, then, yeah. As my hair just keeps on. So, retweet it's this from what's... Minute. Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's, it's hot in New York right now. There you go. Yay. So look out on your Twitter for that tweet from at what's trending with the I hashtag do. hope. Thank for you. Children. It was wonderful Thank meeting you. Thank you so much. You're so sweet. Sorry, you Have a wonderful evening. Yeah, you can <laughs> hand it off to that. Bye. 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 She was so cute, so pretty. Yeah, the way way back. You're a big fan. Well, yeah, I love how she was like, shut up. No, I wasn't. Like, Don't even talk about this. I movie. like, I actually enjoy. She was like this. elbowing me. No, I wasn't. I think it's more because I'm a lefty and I'm right next to you. So you it's think real, it's real elbow. I forgot you're lefty. Let's go to Twitter. She's and Canadian and she's lefty. Give some live shout outs right now, hey. shall we? Yes. Let's do it. All right, let's go. I've been looking I up. love Tony Bennett. Yeah. I have like a Tony Bennett hangover. <laughs> That's definitely a highlight when you meet people. It like was, such it was. Like there's very few people that you'd be like all like, oh, like I was definitely, oh. oh. We have uh, Pink Pink Emily, thanks for watching. Hi, Emily Hutchinson, thanks uh, for who watching. Who is asking a question for Carrie Android, and we will ask that when she is here on the red carpet. Mad Cat loves Tony Bennett. We love Tony Bennett too. We did. Uh, Paul underscore B727 uh, says, look at Bill Nye with People. Yeah, yeah. A curse <laughs> You're word. You're not sort of curse on Twitter. A curse Don't word. Don't you know? Uh, we have a ton more people tweeting. Uh, shout out to Emmy Lacroix as well, who's watching right now and sharing with her friends. Remember to the hashtag Hope the Number Four Children will be asking those questions and giving you a shout out. That's what we do here yeah. on the blue carpet. Spread the word. Uh, so we have a local athlete here representing New York, Prince. I'm a Kamura. <laughs> yeah, good. You said it. You said it pretty good. That was pretty good. Can you say it for Amu Kamara? Amu Kamara. Yeah. Amu I, need, you, I need you just to say it more quickly, though. Amu Kamara. Amu Kamara. What's yeah. your nickname, though? Um, Prince. Prince. Were you yeah. named after Prince? No, oh. no, 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 no. I could dance like him maybe a little bit, but. Please many, do. How no, how please. That'll go viral. You, you need to dance for your charity What's right your now. Dance? What's your dance of choice? Um, I don't have a dance of choice. I mean, uh, my teammate Cruz, he has a salsa, but I, um, I don't know. If I was in the end, I'd probably do something more tribal too. More or something, <laughs> yeah. I, I won't do it right now because I'm in, I'm in like a professional. Um, setting right now of course yeah i think we need to come up with a signature dance for you i gotcha <laughs> tell us about what you're supporting here tonight the charity that you want to spread the word about um it's hope hope for children and samsung's doing a great job with um bringing hope for children with providing um needs needs for them and i think that's huge coming from a third world country nigeria and um and i think they're, they're doing a great job what is your hope for children man man that's a loaded question um I would say, um, I don't know, just daily um, necessities, uh, maybe like like water, uh, clothing, or um, gosh, this kind of sounds corny and cheesy, but just trying to make um, this generation 
better for my um, for my kids so they so they can leave it so they could live in and stuff like that. Trying to leave it better. That's great. Thank you. That's a beautiful thing. We actually did have a question that's from the interwebs. All right. So, and I'm asking some of uh, this to some other teammates tonight as well. So, there's several gifs online of Eli Manning hanging his head fresh in frustration. Have you seen this one? Oh, um, like. Is so it, like it trended on Reddit recently. Wow. Uh, it was the premature celebration subreddit. Can you give me your best Eli Manning face? Wow, man. Um, <laughs> did so much my, my, uh, Did Mark do it too? Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so you should have done the dance. You should have done the, the right. end zone I dance. Should, I should have done that. Oh, man. Uh, we'll make a gif out of that, too. I'm thank sure. you. Thank we'll you so much. Viral. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Have a, have a wonderful today. night. And thanks for conti your continued support of Hope for Children. Thanks, for And it will be, do, should we do a selfie? Yes. Do We're going to do a selfie. You're going to retweet it. And the selfie that gets the most retweets tonight when we, po when we post it, $5,000 more to your charity. OK, are you ready? Yeah. Let's go to this, uh, the picture. One second. There's a lot going on. I'm going to Twitter. So much everything. is going on. I know. All right, let's go back to the camera. I'm multitask. I'm a typical young ADD generation. All right. That's enough. Yeah. All right. I need to. Someone needs to. All right. Can you hold this for sure. me? Sure. Clap it down. I have so many. I have so many pieces of technology. There you go. You're gonna <laughs> see that on our Instagram shortly. Thank you so much. Uh, have a great day. Bonnie Wright. Ooh. Who, She's was in Jenny Harry, Harry Potter. Potter. She is wow. joining us right now. Tweet us with your hashtag, with your questions. Hashtag hope the number four children. Come on in, Bonnie. Oh. Yeah. Nice to <laughs> see you. There you I go. Will. Come on down. We are, you wore get... blue on the blue carpet. I know. Nice. And we're gonna give some people shout outs who are watching right now because if you tweet with the hashtag hope the number four children, any celebrity here might just give you a shout out on air. So you want to give uh, some of these folks shout outs right now? Oh, no. Okay. I'll go. Oh, right now. Okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> shout like you're out putting me to work. To, it would bite um, me over. Rob, Anna, Sophia, who's most excited to see Carrie and Underwood tonight. A lot of them. Yes. Um, and this is um, Katie Page that um, tweeted. Yeah. Tonight. Thank you for the tweet. Everyone's got to remember hashtag. Oh, we have children. this one. It's uh, going to be a selfie. Oh, so yeah. oh yes. Uh, yeah. Rose, a lot of Carrie yeah. Underwood fans watching right now. So, who are you excited to see tonight? Well, Carrie Underwood, of course. Yeah. Um, also a big um, fan of Susan Sarandon, so I'm pleased yeah. to hear her um, story that she has to tell, so that'll be fun. And what charity are you supporting here tonight? Um, well, I hope for children is a um, uh, very interesting subject for me because yeah. Samsung is a big supporter of another organization that I've been doing work with called Many Hopes, which um, is also another children's charity that they're um, doing a gala for in a few weeks' time. So that's why I'm here. Very nice. Well, that, when, what is that charity all about? Um, yeah, Hope for Children is basically um, it's basically a set of um, homes for, for young children who have either experience sort of maybe they don't have their parents or they ex experience different sort of um, sexual violence or sort of domestic violence and they basically take them in within their home and sort of teach them what it is to be a child and give them the support to maybe put them through education and so they're basically housing for children who don't have a home. That's so nice. What is your hope for children that you want to share with everyone and we encourage you all if you're watching share your hope for children tweet with the hashtag hope the number four children right now. Um, yeah, my hope for children is um, the hope that they get the power of an education, and I think that's the most important thing to to change the pattern of poverty and and sort of injustice, sort of generally for children. You're so well spoken, and everything <laughs> sounds better when you're British. Oh, that's I wish sweet. I was. You get away Don't you get sick of yeah? You can say you can say anything and do that. Like, really I'm sick of my yeah. voice, honestly. Well, just swap. Just pretend. Yeah, can I? Just be British for the day. Is there an app for that? Yeah, yeah. There's swap to voice be swap. <laughs> Voice they have like auto tune for the singing they can have the British app. <laughs> exactly, you know? that's yeah. awesome. I'm gonna make that Samsung call me. <laughs> well, yeah, thank you so go. much for being here tonight. Thank you, you Bonnie. Have a lovely it. evening. And of course, we have uh, Hoda coming up. Hoda, like, Hoda, like, and I'm actually. Uh, that's fine. We need Hoda's walking. Up. We need a break. To I, I'm my... still exhausted from the Shira keeping Bill Nye here for 25 minutes. Do we have a little oh break God. of uh, no. a video? <laughs> we I'm just to... laughing. Bill Nye, you talked to him for like 25 minutes. I'm sorry. You would so not. I was trying to get him to say something like breaking news or it something. It was fascinating. Because, because the problem is when you argue with him, that's when you get viral. But if you actually think he's cool and like. So like that's him. it. So I'm, I'm, I'm like, Shira is standing here trying to get 
Bill Nye to go viral. That was your hope. That was your hope for children. Know. What else do that I Bill need to Nye do, Bill? Would go viral. What do I need to do, Bill? That was fascinating. Uh, but you know, actually, he's been on a lot of our shows in the past, so we're all buddies and friends. Yeah. And it was so great to have him come out here uh, to support Hope for Children and, of course, spread the love. And right now we oh, have I love Estelle, Estelle. Uh, who's been actually coming out with some new music. I was Absolutely. Out SoundCloud hey, recently. girl. Estelle, how's it How going? Are you? Nice to see you. Mom, a lot of air kisses going Estelle on. Estelle and I co-hosted some red carpet something, three something years so long ago. An award ago. show, I think. An award show. I, think I remember that. Yeah, we have fun. We you look beautiful in a Thank rock you. and a pantsuit. Who designed I, I'm that? I'm just opening ceremony. Oh. I'm glad it's myself. I'm quite I love it. It's very nice. Thank looks you. looks nice against the blue carpet. I know. Red and very blue. nice. And you've been coming out here. This isn't your first time this at This is like my children. fourth year. Thank they, you. They've supported everything I've done. You guys have supported everything I've done with my foundation, um, All of Me. So I have to come back and support every single year. And tell people watching what All of Me is all about. All of Me is a mentoring foundation. We started as a pure mentoring course and we kind of evolved into like a fundraising body to help people who are actually on the ground doing the work. The more we got into it last year, the more we started to realize that people were doing the work, they just needed the help and the funding. You know, it's based on education. And people have their views on, you know, whether education is worth the money or not, which is crazy. But, you know, so we've decided to help people out there on the ground doing the work. And Samsung have been an amazing sponsor. Hope for Children have been an amazing support. So, absolutely, we're here again. We're here again. Oh, that's great. And what is your hope for children that you want to share tonight? I hope that children... <laughs> I'm like, wait. Yeah, we're looking, we're popping up in real time. The hashtag, hope the I hope your hope children. comes true. Yeah, yeah, Mark. So, for instance, Mark says, no. oh, she just moved. I agree with My hope is that one day children will nev not have to experience cancer. What is, I, I what is your My hope, hope for children? My hope is that no one will have to experience cancer, but my hope for children is that they see the world as we saw when we were younger, brighter, bigger, and full of possibility. You know? I love hashtag that. Hashtag amen. Sure. And uh, you've been coming out with some new music. I, I checked out your I did, SoundCloud. I did, I did. You know, it's hard when you're like when you're coming out with your new music this yeah. season because there's so many places you can host it. Right. Like, kind of like under cover but not right right so i was like where i was like researching right. uh, uh tell us about the new ep oh, and what goodness. That we have a new album coming in september it's called true romance um the last record everyone heard from me was break uh, was a breakup record so i wanted to do something that was a little bit more realistic it's coming out in september i'm so excited nice. like, we go with the next single conqueror in about a week so i think everyone's gonna love that one and what can people expect from this sound it's obviously more mature you M mature definitely grown up definitely an adult um but you know just big uh worldly and a little bit more relatable to everybody I think everyone's gonna understand what it, I think everyone understands what it feels like to break up and just be in that in-between space awesome. that's where I'm at so this is what I've been writing about well, well, thank you know. so much you still have a wonderful thank evening you. and we thank you for coming by and we will yeah, be fun. doing a selfie with you uh, to share with the interwebs when you see okay. uh, the tweet come up I will retweet basically it. you have to retweet it because the celebrity that gets the most retweets tonight five thousand dollars more okay, to their you, come on fans come on my darlings Thank you so Thank much. You're so. lovely. Probably. Have a great night. It was great, great to night. see you. It was great to Have see you again. Thank you. Oh, I was going to kiss your hand too. No, I'm there. <laughs> All right. Thank you. We have Hoda coming Hoda out. Hoda lady who? Hoda, Hoda woman, Hoda, Hoda lady. We have uh, some of the biggest TV personalities, musicians, athletes. Hold a lady. Here on the blue carpet. Look how beautiful she looks in blue she on the blue carpet. Blue. blue on blue on blue. Oh, hey, girl. I, Emmy nominated? Who the hell are you people? Oh, oh my God. It's all me. It's all we me. We just tried to <laughs> bring out all the steps here. Hi, Hoda. Yeah. How's it going? How are you? You look you beautiful. Guys. Thanks for supporting this of entire course. event. Of course. Uh, Where else would I be tonight? Come on. Agree. Right? I it. mean, the Tony's are already over, so there's no more Tony Hi. Did you love the Tony's? What was I your favorite was... Tony moment? Hugh jumping. Do you know what, what I did when he was doing that? Yeah. I was in my apartment because yeah. I wanted to see how hard is it to jump like that? Not up and down like you're jumping rope, yeah. but forward. Yeah. I did like four jumps in my apartment because that's how long it is. I literally was like, <sighs> Ooh, yeah, so then I was watching him same. and he kept going and then he jumped rope with Rocky and then he jumped on the stage. He's in He's good not human. shape. He's not human. I was He's into in... that. <laughs> you were into that. And I was a little worried about the nip thing with uh, Fantasia. Yep. After midnight, her after her tatas yeah. were totally busting. What, what yeah. a great viral moment for you to talk about. Um, we did. Can you like wait uh, for those moments? I was like, like uh oh, yes. it's happening. Now, 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 go. I know. So <laughs> tell us about your a charity that you want to spread the message about tonight. There's a charity called Groove With Me, and there are a bunch of young girls in Harlem, and the graduation rate there is almost, I think it's below 50%. Among the girls who tap dance and, and, and do dance at Groove With Me, the graduation rate is in the high 90s. So it's about a discipline, it's about having a place to go, it's about having people who care about you. It's a small charity, but I gotta tell you, it's one of those that when I found them, I fell in love. The kids can't wait to get there to show up, and sometimes you're 
your neighborhood's a scary place. These kids have found a way to feel safe and to and to graduate. I mean, there's a track record. It's Amazing. a lot of things they tell you there's that some, there's something good and you never really see results. This is small enough you can see it happen. Well, that's right. what I love. I love seeing results. And yeah. it makes you feel like when it's local, it's something yes. more special to you. Right, yeah. exactly. What's your hope for children that you want to share with everyone tonight? You know what? I think I think it's that you want kids to just live a safe and happy life. It sounds very basic, no, but when you no. but when you've yeah. met kids who literally the walk from ho from home to school is scary, and school may be the safest place they they ever are during the course of their day. Yeah. You know, you just you just wish for that. And sometimes, I mean, this sounds weird, but I was one time I was at a housing project and I was talking to a young boy, and he said, um, "Where's your mom and dad?" And I said. Well, I said, my dad passed away when I was in, in uh, college. I said, he died. And he said, he died. He said, who killed him? Oh. Who killed him? You know why? Because that's how people die right. in their mind. No one has a heart attack. Anyway, so I just hope for kids to have a safe and happy Thank place you, to go. We're Thank gonna you, Hoda. Thank you so much. With you. I can't Thank wait. And then we so are. So excited. Yes. Okay. Thank you. you. Know how it works. Whose phone is this? It's mine. <laughs> of course it is. Do you want to give, all right, here, do you want to give me one, another phone? Because right now, there's a bunch of stuff happening on this phone right now. So we're going to do it. another, Sam. We're like building some phones yeah. and tablets right now. Okay. All right, Jesus and then take the how wheel. it works is we're going to take a selfie and we're going to tweet it. You're so and, crazy. And celebrities, the celebrity gets the most retweets. She's like rubbing your back. What's it. going on here? Feels good. Massage is happening. What happens? The celebrity that gets the most retweets. What happens? Five thousand of your charity. charity. What? Do so you want oh, to tell all your friends? Me. Yeah. You're tell. not even in it. I oh. come on. <laughs> ah. There That's we the title go. of my new book. You're not even in it. Forward by Hoda Kotb. Now I know why you got the Emmy. That be. Now I know why you got the Emmy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Hoda. Have a, time time. It was so great Have a wonderful you. evening. Well, well, that's hilarious because um, Carrie is coming. We're so excited. I Carrie know. Underwood is coming. And I want all your questions. And they were like, rap, rap, rap. I'm like, Carrie Underwood's coming. So now uh, she's. And I know we have so many people are excited. Uh, tweet with the hashtag I'm Hope so Number excited. Four Children. I hope because she knows we are who taking I am. your questions live. You can actually give me my phone right now because I want to take those questions. Make sure uh, you take a everyone. good one. And take a picture with my phone. Take a picture with your phone. No, I, no, that phone's dead. But to, make sure you take a picture with that phone. That's my phone. Just said, take as many pictures as you can. Yeah, he's like, my I love like, him, like, Carrie's coming. Take as many pictures of it as you can. Just go, hi, I'm Michael like Buckley, your Twitter friend, Buck Hollywood. I nice know. to meet nice. you. Sure, so oh, nice to meet can you. Can you hold the microphone so we can yes. talk to you? So we're kind of live right now. We are okay. live right now on the interwebs. Awesome. And we, we have are a ton live. of people who have been tweeting you. I appreciate that. A You're, lot of Everything's cute. Everything. Now compliments for I me. You're like a lady. So, <laughs> so, are you Thank guys? you. We didn't plan. No, we no don't. Planning. We just met. You, yeah, no, you match, but met. without being like Thank you. matchy match. Let's Thank talk you. about you because we have okay. so many fans watching right now. So we need to like give them something great. Uh, you're here to also support your charity. Yeah. Not just perform. Yes. Uh, tell us about your charity, which is you know it's all it comes from your hometown, it which does. I thought was so great. Yeah. Well, I come from a really small hometown. Um, about 3,500 people, and. Um, Whenever things started going really well for me, I mean, I, I owe so much to where I'm from and the people that are there, and um, it's been really amazing to just be able to give things like musical instruments and computer labs and, you know, building a... a uh, playgrounds and stuff like that. It's yeah. it's been a lot of fun and scholarships. So it's been it's been cool. I look forward to whatever we're gonna do in the future. Yeah. Have you met those kids that you've impacted, and what does that make you feel like when you see that in front of your own very eyes? Um, well, I think just knowing a that somebody that you know made good, and I, I think that's probably one of the best things that um, I could do. Is I just agree. being able to from a small town. Yeah. This girl did it. Yeah, I do it too. exactly. Yeah. And I, mean, I, I was so lucky, you know, growing up in Oklahoma, like I did, because we had so many country music superstars like Reba and Garth and Toby Keith and yeah, um, yeah Ronnie Dunn, and just the list goes on and on. People like that that I got to look up to. And if they grew up in a town like me and they were off <laughs> conquering the world, I could do it too. That's awesome. That's so empowering. And I just feel like also country music has evolved so much. Yeah. It's so I'm great obsessed to see how, with country music. I think it's because of you come, too. Right? I am. I am. Well, it's, I'd say right now it's such an exciting time to be in country music, to be a country music fan, because you really can turn on the radio and find something that you'll like, because there's a lot of different 
kinds of artists on the radio. It's and there's not, lyrics. You yeah. can hear them singing lyrics that yeah. mean something, yeah. you know. Stories so. and yeah, real real life. Real life. Is it sad for you to see Idol saying goodbye after all these years? They're not leaving. What's that? What's this? <laughs> They're not goodbye. No, the I ratings mean, are low, but it's not. No, canceled. did they say that it was well, ending? No, it's no. renewed. No. I, I can say though, when I was on season four, like I remember the producers kind of setting us down and saying, "Look, it's season four. Like it's erosion. It was, the ratings probably not aren't going to be, you know, what they what they were last year, or whatever. And then they were better. And then the next year they were better. So right, I mean, right. we're going into my season was not. Nine seasons ago. I mean, that's Wild. insane. So, it's um, it's it's gone a very long time. Yeah. And I, well, not we have to take selfies. Like, I know. And now we have to get her inside. Like, what is, you finally, have a million things to what do. What is your I'm hope sorry. for children? Because we're telling everyone to share their hashtag hope number for children tonight. My my wish your for hope them. For children, or my, yeah. Um, I mean, I just think it's so important for them to know that they really can do anything. Um, and and you look at some of the people that are going to be here tonight or be honored tonight. Um, just strong people that defied odds or, um, yes. you know, like I, we were talking about, came from a small place like me, and um, really anything is possible. Awesome. Nice. Well, let's we're take our selfie. We have to let her go. How this like, works is, let me tell uh, you, because yeah, we're going to be, oh, yeah, turn around for Instagram, because it's a vertical. <laughs> Okay. There, you have to do vertical, or else it's not gonna. It's oh. gonna get more complicated. Okay. So we're gonna tweet you uh, okay. this picture, and hopefully someone, you know, I know you're not always on your phone. Hopefully, because you have a lot to it's do. In my purse. Um, so when you see uh, it, the, the celebrity own. with the most retweets gets Lean five thousand dollars more for their charity. So. Yeah, cute. Awesome. Cute. You're so sweet. I will, okay. I will so I was trying to be tweeting it. Oh, Kishira. another one. <laughs> He's gonna, you know, he needed to, he needed to document this moment. Yeah, oh, I love you. I'm such a big fan. Thank you for being here tonight. Thank it's wonderful you. meeting you. I appreciate love it. you in the sound of music too. Thank you. It's awesome. It's just a love fest here. You're so sweet. Go inside. I know. Have a wonderful night. Have a great night. Say goodbye to Say all your bye. fans watching. Me too. I'm nice sure. to meet you as well. You're Thank so you. And bye, bye. everyone. Like all the fans. The fans all the fans watching live. Exactly. Hoda even wants to see Carrie. Hoda's like, where's Carrie? People are freaking out. Hoda's ready to see. Oh, the Cruz is here! The there you go. Continues. Excitement continues. How's it going? It's going very well. We won't ask you to dance. We okay. might. No, I want to see the Latin. Maybe. It's, I it's a little warm. The, the I'll do it by myself, though. It's, I'll do it. What partner. is it? Oh, oh my God, there you oh, go. Oh, that's the vibe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can, you yeah. want me to jiff this? Yeah, yeah. Interwebs, you should jiff this. Shira Lazar's hips don't lie. <laughs> I'm going to be putting this on Tumblr tomorrow. Wow. It'll be a gif. <laughs> oh, and my it's God. It's a gif. A gif. I don't know, gif, oh, gif. Oh, man. Eli Maybe. Manning had a recent, you know, for his frustration, Jeff. Did you see that? Did you even yeah. So we're asking, we're asking everyone here, you guys, to do what's your best Eli Manning impression? It's a challenge. It's a challenge. It's an acting it's just exercise. Kinda, it's just one of those faces where it's just... Uh, <laughs> one of those. One of those. He's gonna kill me when he sees oh, it. No. Gonna love just so it. you know, no. he's gonna kill me. No. <laughs> no. You just want to create emotion. It's all about creating real emotion. That's all. What it, that's what it's all about. So when you're on the yeah. field, do you ever trash talk anybody? Any you know, trash talker? Sometimes. Sometimes yeah. kind of provoke me. I'm not that guy, but I get provoked a lot, and sometimes it gets competitive. It's yeah. all competitive nature. We all shake hands after the game and stuff like that. But it's um, it's 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 a lot of fun. Nice. So what's been going on lately? You guys, you guys are obviously playing. We're in OTAs right now, yeah. off-season workout program, and we're just uh, getting ready, learning a new offense, uh, adjusting to some new teammates. We're excited to be out there playing and looking forward to training camp in July and getting, mm -hmm. getting to that new season. Do you really, like, get yourself prepped? Do you, do you have to have, like, a crazy regimen during the off-season to stay in shape and everything? Yeah, but it's become somewhat of a lifestyle. Eat right, work out properly, and it's um it's developed into a lifestyle that I'm I feel like a slob after like two days of not doing anything. So it's uh, it's worked out for me. If you weren't eating right, what would be your favorite thing to pick out on? If I said, eat whatever you want right now. I would have pounds of Rice Krispie treats. Oh my God, that's I could eat those things like. Well, now people are gonna bring those to their games. Like, he said he wanted Rice Krispie treats. <laughs> that's not gonna be your crazy. thing next season. Never know. Yeah. The Rice Krispie Never treat know. guy. It started right here. Yeah. Endorsement, gotta, endorsement. See Kellogg's see calling. Make something yeah. viral. Uh, tell us what charity you're here to support tonight. I'm here on behalf of the Victor Cruz Foundation, yeah. but I, obviously this charity is something that's very dear to my heart. Eric Legrand is someone that's I've known for such a long time, and, yeah. and uh, for him to be getting honored is is tremendous uh, for him. He's a he's a guy we text all the time back and forth. I see him everywhere, and uh, he's always so upbeat and so uplifting. It makes me, uh, you know, it, it inspires me to continue my day in life. Yeah. And what is your hope for children that you want to share tonight? We encourage everyone else share the hashtag #HopeTheNumberForChildren. We're giving you shout outs. We're retweeting you. Spread the word.
Um, my hope for children is that they continue to just live their life to the fullest and live positive, influential lives for everyone else. Don't be into the negativity. Don't buy into it. Um, stay focused on your task, on your goal at hand, and everything else to take it, uh, take its course. Well, thank you so much for being thank here. You, thank you. Have a wonderful it. evening. No thank you very Good much. Good luck next season. Thank Rooting you. for you. Thank you. Thank I you. love the Eli Manning Wait, look. Oh, we're going to oh, yeah. at this point. Okay. It's a live selfie. Uh, I have so many. At this point, I have like so, so many, many pieces of products. Right, right. That's my actual phone. It is. That is. It's really oh, nice. You, oh, there you go. Thank you. All right, put it like this. Oh yeah. There we go. Thank you. Thank We're you. We're retweeting this, and when you see it, retweet it. The celebrity that gets the most retweets, five thousand dollars to your charity. Okay. Thank Do you. Do it. Right. Competition continues. Have a wonderful night. evening. Right, have a good night. Thank you. Do you take that? I have so many. Pass things. that back. So many devices. There you go. Oh, we have some of the stars from Ooh, Orange is the New Black. I love Black. Orange is the New Black. Uh, so be sure to tweet us your qu questions with the hashtag hope, the number four children. I'm on Twitter right now. We're going to give you some shout outs, everyone. Look at Carrie. She oh, loves yeah. me. I love her. I Carrie cut Angela, you how like, hot bye. is that? Well, because I know you want it if you're own. Would you move over thing. a little? Move over a little. Am I the only one following directions? <laughs> so uh, let's see who. Uh, oh, shout out to Derek Milf Milfite says to the five-year-olds who held the door open for me and my family. Oh. That's a different, that's too, that's a different, that's not, that's, that you're on Hope for Children with no letter F. That's a different oh, Hope for Children. Oh, hashtag Hope. You need the, the Hope The number four. four children. What am I saying? What oh, am I saying? Like, hello. Hi. Oh, one of my favorite shows right now. Orange is the New Black. Welcome we to our. It. How's it going? How are you doing? I'm good. I just got out of prison. How I know. You look amazing. <laughs> it's not really good. Thank you. How's the food there? <laughs> Cynthia, I'm lucky. Makeup. <laughs> nice. It's nice to have makeup, right? It's like, I feel like now you're no, like, you obviously you become this huge star and you were always an amazing actress, but because of the show, but you're always, you guys are pretty raw. Yeah, we right? are. We're like our natural selves. Yeah. And then now people see you all glammed up because and you're it, like, but I like who that. Who dat? Who dat? Who dat? Who dat? <laughs> I tell them all the time, you could put a, you could put pimples, you could put tattoos, I don't care, because I yeah. want to look glamorous on the carpet where it counts, right? you know? What's it like being part of a show that the whole world is watching and buzzing about? It must be very gratifying and feel great. If you, you're validated as an actor. I think that the whole message that we're sending out there, you know, being part of such a great project as far as diversity, yeah. issues that have, totally. have been swept under the rug and are now coming to light, and so many people are so up for having a conversation about it and actually accepting it. You know, size of women, curvaceous and being sexy and having the the guy, you know, the prince of the show, exactly. you know, that's always good. Um, but no, you know, I think I'm, I'm humbled, I embrace it, I'm proud of it, and the end product shows, you know, the fans are loving it, the critics are loving it. Did you, you know, know that it was going to be this big? No, like when you, you don't prepare. You, never know. Yeah. you don't prepare. And what is your hope for children? Hope for children uh, to, to maintain corporations like these. I'm a Samson fan, uh, investor, owner. And the fact that they contribute to the children, which are our future, I think that children live by memories. We all remember growing up who, who's there, who's not, and for them to support education, health, sustainability, I think that's essential for us to grow together as humans, as beings, as just, you know, being part of the world. You know? That is so awesome. awesome. I want to ask you more new black questions, but we can't. Yeah. It's okay. I'm going to find yeah, you, I guess. I'll we have find to take you a selfie time. before you go. Oh, yeah, we need to take a selfie. Let's, Let's, do, a, Let's do a prison Stay tuned. selfie. Martha oh, yeah, Stewart. can we do a prison selfie? I'm getting text uh, messages from from people. Everyone's freaking out. You have to like do like a like a I know. stance. You Are know? you getting to know more about the prison life? Here, sure. Hold the center. Go ahead. Prison all right. life all day. Hey, what? And you have such so many fun NFA. females. All right. <laughs> what is the prison? Oh. Oh, I'm getting. Was, I was like, it was a duck face. I'm getting yeah, no talks tomorrow. I won't be able to do that tomorrow. And so we're gonna be tweeting now. you, and then you retweet us. The celebrity that gets the most retweets, happening. five thousand year charity. Oh, good. yeah. Martha Stewart. Martha Stewart. Martha Stewart's Coming here. Up next. Here I cannot she wait. Are you tweeting? Is. Is. Mar, she's playing with her we're camera. Wait. She's very into technology. No one will rock. I love. Martha I love Stewart. that whole cast. I love that. Um, the girl came over. We were kind of like, oh hi. Like we were just kind of like, nah. we were just kind of like, oh hi. I what really you... wanted to ask her more about, you know, her. Like, we're here for charity. She, like the couple, the whole. Stay like, focused. I know the storyline. Stay of focused. Have you binge watched Orange the um, I've watched season one. I haven't started season two. I know. I need to get two, into season so. two as well. But I'm a big binge watcher too. I mean, I'm sure. I mean, it's funny how now I actually save shows on my DVR, so I will be able to watch like three at a time because I like watching a lot at once. No, so Martha is things. here, but she's taking lots uh, of photos. We wanna, let's so. give a shout out to some of the people who've been And we didn't even us. know she was coming. So hey, Martha, hey. Uh, 
We have people. Oh well, look at Tony Bennett tweeting. That's oh, funny. that's sweet. Martha Stewart. Yeah, I'm come sure on now. We have to wait because there is a. It comes through. A woman There's who so needs many no introduction, through. but here she is anyway. Martha Stewart. Martha Stewart. Right from my Samsung Galaxy. Wow, well, oh, awesome. It. Welcome. You need to take your mic. Here, come. You can you hold come the right mic? Here. I know we're okay. fancy nice here. To meet you. Nice, I'm Michael Shearer. Nice uh, thanks we're for having us. We're huge fans, obviously, and I love how you use technology. You're like very, always very savvy. I I'm trying. You try. I'm trying. I. I try to adopt as soon as I as soon as I see something that's interesting. Are you still yeah. online dating, or is that? Uh, yeah. yeah, there's some weirdos out there. No, 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 I don't no. have time. Yeah. No Tinder. I'm busy, 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 busy. <laughs> I think it's funny because everyone asks, like, talks about DIY these days, but you were like the originator of DIY. I right? know. Yes, indeed, and uh, we're still doing a lot of DIY. I know. Yeah. And uh, and it's fun. Who do you think, like, who inspired you to get started to do, you know, there was not, who was your inspiration to do what you did? Oh, well, there's lots of people. Yeah. I mean, you know, Martha Washington. <laughs> the original Martha. Wow, we're like way back now. And who's followed in your kidding. footsteps that you think they do a pretty well, a good lot, job? A lot who do you of think? people are doing, a lot uh, of people. doing lifestyle yeah. businesses or... I, I understand Blake Lively's just starting yes. one, and Gwyneth has her her goop, goop. and um, lots and lots. Joseph like Alba, who's standing right behind me, somewhere. Yes, the honest, honest, yeah. the honest yeah. company. Yeah, with honest she's doing brand. stuff. So uh, a lot of you know, it's a, it's a good business. People really want good products. They want good advice. They want expertise. And I think it's happening. And uh, what advice can you give the people that want to be the next? Everyone wants to be the next Martha Stewart. The Martha Stewart no for the digital thing. age. It's be no, prepared no to work really, really, really hard and put up with a lot of you know what. <laughs> we, can swear. we can swear on the internet. What charity are you here to talk about and support tonight? Well, mine is uh, the Center for Living at Mount Sinai Hospital. Yes. Oh, very nice. I established that. Um, that uh, outpatient ward and uh, it says a lot of really really great work and thank you Samsung very much for helping uh, support my wonderful initiative and thank you for supporting um, everything else tonight too and what is your hope for children that you want to share tonight well I just hope that all children throughout the world have fresh water good food love education and a, and a chance for a good survival Definitely. Well, we Thank want to encourage you. all of you to tweet with the hashtag Hope, the number four children. We're giving you shout outs throughout the night. It's all about interactivity Good. here. Excellent. And we appreciate your time and you coming well, out here to I support this. It. Thank I you. I appreciate you doing And we're going to do a selfie with you. Oh, okay. But oh. How it works is uh, we're going to be tweeting the selfie to you. Okay. Somebody that gets the most retweets. Don't forget, at Martha Stewart. Okay. At Martha Stewart. Do you keep follow up with her. it? Do, of course she you, does. You three you're obsessed. They're, they're you're a bit obsessed. At a girl. You tell Sheila Lazar. I like Do you keep up? I watch it. She's got her Samsung. You do. I do. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. What should we do? There we go. That's Thank a keeper. You. We'll you look you beautiful. You look beautiful. You can win more money to your charity. I hope so. So we're, that we're would be nice. sharing the love. Thank you, Martha. Thank you Have so a wonderful it evening. It was an honor you to meet you. You can um, go, you go that way. That. Oh, You're going to go into our, oh, our mini Bye. control room. Bye. Where do I cross? <laughs> I love her. That was amazing. The, oh, here you go. We're going to start tweeting those right now. It's all, all on our Instagram, Instagram.com slash WT Live. How's it going? Good. How are you today? Nice to see you. Good seeing you. And, oh, no, tell us about what charity you're here supporting tonight. Um, I'm here to support every charity yeah. that, Sam, nice. that Samsung's involved with. Yeah. Um, you know, when it comes to kids, you know, you can't, can't have a better, you know, charity to support. And, you know, especially when it comes to education and, uh, and health and sustainability. Um, it's just amazing. So I'm, I'm just honored to be here. I'm excited to go inside because I was here two years ago. And, you know, it's, it was an amazing event. Yeah, and we uh, talked to some of your fellow New York Giants, right. uh, fellow players. Um, we were talking about this Eli Manning gif that of him being really frustrated. It went viral on Reddit. So we're asking everyone to do their best Eli Manning, uh, Eli Manning uh, like pose or Eli Manning pose. face. Oh man, I don't know if I can make fun of my quarterback. I need him to throw me some bals this year, so I don't know if I can make, I don't know if I can make fun of <laughs> oh, him. Oh, he's not gonna. He doesn't take it seriously. Sounds like me in high school all over again. So what's his face? Everyone has their Eli Manning face. Um, I'm used to Eli, you know, kind of being, you know, funny, you know, happy guy. So I'm gonna give you the old. 
Oh, that's a better that Eli nice Manning one. face. Thank other, you. Other people didn't do that face, really. No. I mean, it's a mixture. It's like a rainbow. Well, when I'm, when I'm around Eli, we're always joking around or, you know, talking about the country life. You know, that's where we were born and raised. So we always have big smiles on our face. So that's Can we see nice. your beautiful ring? I'm yeah. sorry. I'm Whoa, just like, oh, what my the? God. Can we see I wish bling? if we were E, we would do the bling ring cam. Champion. Oh, my. World champion. That's beautiful. Wow, that's beautiful. So, that, you could, you could take someone out with that. Yeah. You know, it's, it's actually pretty heavy, believe it or not. Do you wear that out everywhere? Or um, just special events. Special events. Honestly, this is probably the first time I wore it in like six months or so. It's so beautiful. just just things like this, you know. You know what? I mean, it's New York. You can get yeah. caught on the streets of that. Right. I don't think I'm anyone's gonna mess with you. I don't think <laughs> anyone's gonna mess with you. I'm, I'm not gonna take my chances. Yeah. 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 We're gonna do a selfie right now and tweet right. you, and the Absolutely. celebrity that gets the most retweets, five thousand to the charity. All I'm right. sorry that I keep repeating this, but people need information. All right. Good. All right. All right. One, two, three. There you go. Cute. Thank you so awesome. much. Thank you. Have a great Wonderful night. Evening. We appreciate it. It's a it. pleasure. Good, Good luck next season. Out. Nice to meet you. Have so fun. It's been pretty. a, it's pretty. Been a fun night. I'm so amazed so that pretty. we got uh, Carrie Underwood. That video is going to be up on our channel, YouTube.com. I still have a tense in my shoulder because I was so excited. Like, I can just you feel were. like my shoulder Rebecca was Minkoff like. Rebecca Minkoff is here. Oh, nice. Who, uh, is always fun Come and fabulous. Down. How are you? How are you? I love your look. I love the jacket. It's very nice. unique. I would do this typically. Oh, good. Well, All the time. And you look beautiful. Thank you. Apparently, it's beautiful. in to put a leather jacket over a ball gown right now. Well. Thank God. It's the, the chic, grungy look, right? I don't know. That's you right. could describe it better than I am. I'm just using random words. Tell us why it was important for you to be here tonight. It's important for two reasons. One, I have an incredible relationship with Samsung, and they've been hugely supportive of my Fashion Week show and some other projects we're working on. Yeah. And also, anything to do with children as a mom, uh, I am passionate about. So. And do you have a charity specifically that you support? Uh, I'd say that uh, two main charities are Baby Buggy, which we just had our annual bedtime bash and raised our most amount ever, and that gives back to families in need. And then also No Kid Hungry. One in five children go starving every day in America, and I'm happy that we can support a charity that actually feeds people in the U.S. That's so nice. Tell us about what's it like, like this day and age as a fashion designer, um, how you keep up with so much going on, like stay innovative and use technology, I guess, to innovate what you do. I think we listen to our consumer a lot yeah. via technology um, and just trying to always stay inspired and be excited, whether it be travel or art or music. I think those are the places I go to when I want to get excited again. And what celebrities exciting you right now that you're like, I need to dress you? Oh man, I've had a good crew recently. Giselle's been sporting my stuff. Miss Alba, who was just here. Yeah. Uh, Cameron Diaz. We have a good group. You're nice. lucky. You don't need anything else. That's good. I guess so. That's yeah, nice. that's great. Well, thank you so much for being thank here. You, thank you, Rebecca. So have much. a wonderful evening. Thank you. you look great. Thank, thank you. you. And of course, we want to encourage everyone. We're live streaming now to tweet with the hashtag Hope for Children. We're also going to do a selfie with you. Great. And we're trying to raise money for your charity. So when you see this, retweet it and you can get 5K for your charity choice. Great. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great night. All right. Thank you. And you can get back to uh, the mic. I, I feel like I need to direct everyone. We're multitasking here. Another one of the stars from Orange is the New Black is about to join us. Uh, so that's exciting. I'm excited. Oh, Hello. Come on in. Your, your daughter was just here. <laughs> was she? No, no, that's Selena not my Slater. daughter. What? It's not? No, it's I not. can't separate the two worlds. No, I know. We all look alike. No, but no. you look very different. I mean, but you're the same age, right? You're, you're yeah, right. Your yeah, sister. That's sisters. right. I'm my older sister. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, so tell us about fun being here tonight and the importance of supporting an event like this. You know, the, as a mother, this is extra special for me. Anything that helps and, and promotes, you know, care for our children and our future is a big deal. So, and Samson is doing a wonderful job, and I hope that a lot of people follow suit in what they're doing. Really, it's great. What is your hope for children? Hope for children, I believe all children should have an amazing education and health care. Health care, health care, and education. That's, that's like major, you know. Not a lot to ask for, I think. No, so are similar. you enjoying the response to season two of your very hit show? Oh my God, what is that show called? Or wow. is it New Black? Yeah. Or yes. Black. Yes. It's wonderful. <laughs> it's great, you know, I think the fans are absolutely amazing. We have the best fans. And the show is this runaway hit that oh. yeah. keeps on going, so. And it's also such a new model, right? It is, So it it's is. like not like over six months you're doing promotion. You do like all this promotion, it happens. But then it continues the, the word of mouth. So it's yes. a very interesting thing. It was interesting because even like the ending of season, well, not the ending, but the beginning of season two, a lot of people were coming in and 
just getting on season one. Right. And I yeah. was just like, oh, wow. And so it's just this thing that keeps on growing and growing, word of mouth. And, and I love it. It's, it's, it's such a blessing. And people, I think, are, are responding to how refreshing it is to have new faces, different women on the show. So it's, it's a good That's thing. That's what your co-star said, how diverse the cast it's is, diverse. which is very nice. There's it's, something it's for everyone nice. to want Why to tune not, in and right? root for. Yes, the yes. different characters. It is. Yeah. It's, it's not, you know, cookie cutter. No. Uh, clean and pretty at times and and I think that's what life is so right. it's refreshing what's well, your favorite storyline oh right like I guess we can't uh, we won't do a review sorry we can't spoil. do you binge watch at all you know I'm up to episode seven Good. because I've started we started shooting season three so I'm kind of busy wow. we're all yeah. busy non-stop um, yeah non-stop so but I've gone back I've gone back I have to tell you that I've, I've watched an episode over and over and over again just because I'm in so in love and it just it, it, just crazy about my, my cast members. Awesome. They're just amazing. They are. Awesome. They really are. And they constantly surprise, I think, as a viewer, they surprise us. They I'm do. Sure they surprise you as a They surprise peer. me all the time. Like, I'm, like, watching and calling them or texting them going, oh, my God, you killed it. That was wonderful. Right. So I'm a very lucky, lucky girl. There you well, go. thank you for joining us. Have a wonderful we're gonna evening. Take a we're going to take a selfie with We're going to take a selfie. Let's do it. Yes. Hashtag O and, or, like, or O I N B. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we've been tweeting it. <laughs> that was like a weird episode of Sesame Street. <laughs> that was a good one. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. So yeah. here's a tweet yeah. you. So at what's trending, hashtag hope the number four children. Yes. And retweet it, and we'll hopefully I donate uh, some more money to your charity of choice. Yes, definitely. Thank you. Thank Have you. a wonderful Thank time you. tonight. Enjoy Carrie Underwood. Yes. Tony Bennett. Olympic champion your Sarah favorite. Hughes, my very good friend Sarah. Take your time. Why don't you all wait? Are you really live. best friends? Are you really best friends though? Yes, Sarah. Get him. Hi. He's pretending he's best friends with you. No, we uh, are. This I'm, is, I'm this totally is joking. Here you go. And there's her mother. And this is my mom. So Sarah, Sarah actually put on Instagram an outfit and some shoes. Those Look, are not the shoes I you told thought, you to wear. Yeah, no. He you, wanted to wear the silver this shoes. Is, well, I did this because I wanted to dance. So, Sarah, hold the microphone so we don't lose it. Sarah okay. and I actually do lots of broadcasting Wait, for ICE. We're where always are on. Where are we looking? Would look at me, or okay. there's the camera. I'm gonna look at you. Okay. Because your face makes me happy. Oh, it so makes your face makes me happy. happy. We're getting towards the tag board. Uh, it social. makes me remember all of the fun times there we've go. had broadcasting skating. We've had a lot of fun times yeah. broadcasting skating. So, tell us what brings you here tonight for Hope for Children. Well, uh, you know how I love nonprofits and I love doing. Um, things within my community, and I especially love when I can do skating things within my community. But Samsung has been very, very generous with their support of the Interfaith Nutrition Network, which is a local nonprofit on Long Island where I'm from. And uh, it's a soup kitchen, but it also has housing. So nice. Um, I love doing stuff within my community. I want to help everyone, but uh, right where I grew up. And what is your hope for children in general, all over the world watching? Well, with the interfaith nutrition, it helps, um, it feeds kids so they're not worried about, you, you, they're starving, they have malnutrition, they don't have a place to sleep. So um, this helps them just start to function nice. normally and go to school and focus. So you can imagine, you know, if you don't have food, you don't have water, uh, it's hard to do anything. Absolutely. So a hope for uh, children is to fulfill their destiny and to, you know, have dreams and hopes and be able to try to achieve them and work towards them. So that's the, really the first step to doing it. And if there's any little girls at home who want to be an Olympic figure skating champion, what advice do you have for them? <laughs> Don't do it, run! <laughs> Don't do it, run! Do you still support people, like, uh, moving into a career of what you did? Obviously, you had such success, but it's scary sometimes to, like, wish that sometimes if it's such a hard thing to do. To, to wish to figure skating. Well, when I first stepped on the ice and said, I'm going to go to the Olympics, I want to just learn how to glide. And you take yeah. it step by step. So it's like anything. Right. And it's um, piece by piece and building blocks. And clearly, if you don't like it, you're not going to have the dream to go to the next level. You have the passion. Yeah. yeah and One you have to step at a be time. Able to want, you have to like to work hard because it's a lot of work and it's a lot of continuous work that uh, you don't, uh, nobody sees until you get to a very high level. Right. And discipline. So, and so much just so do you figure skate? No. 
All I can barely. Go I'm like waste. falling. I literally try. No, I I need to do it more. No, but Sarah's the great example of someone who no one ever said, "Oh, this is the best skater. She's gonna win." She just had to work harder and be the best when it counted. So she competed at the highest level. It's shocking. Watch her Olympic performance on YouTube. Sir, 2002, Sarah Hughes. It's the performance of a lifetime. Who Marissa Miller said that was an inspiration to her. Remember? Marissa Mayer. From Marissa Yahoo. Mayer from Yahoo. That's Yahoo, right. Yeah. Yeah. Not, <laughs> not Marissa Miller, that girl who Jude Law used to date. That was less interesting. <laughs> Marissa Mayer. You know way too many things um, in one well, comment. I know. I, mean, yeah. you know <laughs> no. I love it. Well, but thank I love you so Sarah. much. I, I so like sweet. it. And I Shout was... out to our friend uh, Tara Lipinski. It's her birthday. Happy birthday, happy Tara. Birthday, Tara. Wait, I'm going to send a tweet to send her happy yeah, birthday. Let's say, yeah, let's say that. We love yeah. Tara. Happy another actually, one. you should tweet. Another you figure skater do... who worked hard. Another yes. skater. Yes. 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 You guys should do an Instagram video and like tweet it to her. We should. We will. What did Martha Stewart say when she was She was adorable and fun, and she's no longer eye-lying dating, and she is a I know, she didn't want to get into the dating. No. I was asking her if she fine. was on Tinder. She has. Oh, Tinder. We That's... actually have to go, so we'll take our selfie. Oh, we'll take a selfie. That. Sarah, look here. Oh, this is Sean Avery. This is a ranger. I know. No. Sarah, focus. Sorry. Look here. Look. I have a focus problem. Sarah, sometimes. leave it. Sarah's a big Rangers fan. She's. All right, thank you. So Sean okay, yeah, Avery oh, is I about to stop. get there. Sarah wants a selfie. One? Okay, yep. She's. Oh, turn it around. Oh. Thanks, Mom. There you go. Cute. All right, I love you so much. Oh. Okay, I'm Have a good thank night. You so much. Thank you. Uh, give that to Damon, yeah. We'll see you inside. Well, that was a lot to process. Are you freaking out? No, I'm not freaking out. Just, we're very good friends, so I just want to see her and spend time yeah, with her. Yeah, so nice. It's weird to be like... It's we're like, going to move here because oh. uh, we want to move where the tag board is and give someone a shout-out. So Avery's shout here. Shout-out to at Mora Cares to have a rewarding future. So we're asking everyone what your hope for children is tonight. Hashtag hope the number four children. Let us know. Sean Avery now See, there are the shoes. Here. She was lying. How are you doing? Hi. Hey, well, you talk a lot. That's well, what we do. We'll be quiet. It's a live stream. <laughs> Wow, what are you like on a date? So I know it's a good first date. You guys talk a lot. Um, Is that well? At least you're honest. I, I like brash, I, honest guys. Yeah, I don't know. It's been a while since I've been on. I know because you have a beautiful uh, girlfriend. Beyonce. Beyonce. Yeah. How's that going? Don't get it twisted, boo. She stole my fiance. So it's going well. It's okay. So far, so good. Have you yeah. set a date? Uh, we haven't. No. That's okay. I think we might be doing a wedding special, so. Oh. oh you're waiting for the contract, the wedding special we have project. To wait. Nice. That's Sign so our life away. Nice. This day and age. That's sick. It's did, you, did, you, did you ever think that would have happened for you? I knew that I was going to sell myself out. Public right? love. Day one. Why, why get married and be in love if a whole the whole world isn't going to get Pointless. to watch it? Pointless. Do you feel com competition with the Kardashians? Like they're special? Oh, I, I mean, like I do you think they... that she's going to, you know, try to one up? They had the sun setting on yeah. them during their vows. I think that's pretty tough to beat. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, they I also mean, had a lot of other stuff for like millions of dollars. I think that's did. harder than the sunset. No. Timing your sunset so that you say oh, so I do. so it's not about the money. And you love your fiance. It will just happen to be a made-for-TV event, not a made-for-TV event that just happens to be a wedding. Of course. <laughs> Well said. Thank you. Wow. So what brings you here tonight? Tell us about the charity you're supporting. Uh, I am here supporting a charity called Friends Indeed, which gives, um, it's a support group for people that are living with loved ones that are terminal with HIV. Oh. So it's, nice. a, you know, it's a, it started in Soho, New York, um, 30 years ago. A woman named Cy O'Neill started it. And, uh, you know, I think it's whenever you think of charity, you always think of somebody that's initially affected with it, and this thinks about the people surrounded by it, so it's... It's very it's, nice. Uh, it's very cool. Nice. Yeah. yeah. You don't have to get all sad and... No, it is. I, when I hear so much about nonprofits... Right now. <laughs> <laughs> He's amazing. Uh, we talk too much. We're sad. I feel doubly insulted. Right. I like your tie. I appreciate <laughs> the comment about the tie. Compliment. One right. for three. I'll take uh, it. Tell us about what your hope for children is that you want to share with everyone. Uh, you know, I think that, that my hope for children is probably not that they have fresh drinking water or that anything like that. I think they just wake up and they're confident to be themselves. They don't take any shit. And How did you find that confidence? He had fresh drinking water. <laughs> <laughs> my mother was very hard on me. Yeah, that helps. <laughs> well, she was, but... Uh, you know, I don't know. It's It was an evolution. I guess it was one day I woke up and said, man, I'm so good looking. I should just go take over the world. <laughs> Everyone should have that confidence. Let's take though. a selfie of all that good looking. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, you're like, so 
He's a right. funny guy. Yeah. He is funny. You are. Did you ever see my watch what happens? He's very, he's, he's obviously sarcastic. I'm trying to be funny. You are. Chin down. Oh, I didn't know. There Thank you go. You. And so when, when we tweet you uh, and you retweet it, the celebrity that gets the most retweets, $5,000 to your charity. I heard that. Charity. I don't think that's going to happen with oh, you. Oh, have Andy Cohen you tweet it. You have to believe in your, in your Twitter following. That's a good idea. Have Andy oh, tweet yeah. it. Can you text Andy to tweet good. it? And have Sarah Jessica Parker right, so and we're all gonna those people. We're going to tweet it in like the next five minutes, so be on the lookout. Okay. There Thank you, you Sean. Have a wonderful evening. Thank this is you. how it works. That was fun. Oh, we're taking a break. We well, we kind of are. We have uh, Jessica Zor who's oh, coming up. Oh, do the social. Um, we also are, of course, encouraging you all to tweet the hashtag Hope the Number Four Children. Um, when I can get the phone, we can give you guys all a shout out. This has been kind of crazy. Jessica Stam and Jessica like, Sorla from this, Gossip Girl. They what do, come what over? do you think of live? Because what do I you, think of live? Because you do all your vlogs, and it's obviously you cut it up a lot. I love it. No, I don't cut it up. I'm one take, first take. You are? Yeah. But thanks wow, for watching. So, this girl no, doesn't know a thing about me. I feel like I know that, but I'm then I'm first take, one take. Really? They call me one first take. take. First take, one take. Is I'm that, a oh, that, so, yeah. Do you do that in, so for I'm everything just, in your life? I am, yes. First take, long. I've already been insulted by Sean Avery. I don't need to be insulted by Shira Lazar. Hashtag bye. <laughs> uh, so um, what was the highlight for you tonight? Carrie Underwood. Carrie yeah. Underwood. It was fun. No, I love being live. I mean, I'm, yeah. I love being live. I used to do live shows for like three I know, hours. I and know, I know. Blah, blah, and you also were a finalist on... Uh, live with Calais. Live with Calais. It was, with fun. Wasn't it was that great. Fun? Yeah, I was hoping to see teeth, Rob Thomas. Your teeth get very white. Thank Even you. more white every time I see you. Press white strip, shout out. They're not a sponsor, but they should be. <laughs> um, but yeah, so um, Rob Thomas is, is here, I believe. And he, yeah, he, he performed actually last he year. He was there when I won, and I like hugged him, so I was really hoping that he would be here. But our, our girls are here. Yes. Jessica and Jessica. Hi, yeah, Jessica. 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 They, they showed up together. I, know, like, I, mean, I checked out your Instagrams and you were like always hugging Instagrams together. Or, like the, it, like yeah, the music festivals. And everything. She's like, do we? What? <laughs> so I was like, yeah. yeah. I, know. I mean, well, she's one of my best friends. So Aww, we like to have fun together that's and nice. sweet. come here to support yeah. Samsung. Yeah. yeah. Together. Tell us about being here tonight and why you guys think it's important to come out here to support this. Well, um, so I met Susan who puts on this event, yeah. Susan Grant, and she's just been such a wonderful supporter of um, the philanthropic work that we do and um, we work with this children's organization called Hope, Many, Hopes. Many Hopes which is almost a Hope for Children but um, so Hope for Children uh, Help. Samsung helps Samsung helps us to yeah. You know, fun things for many hopes, and yeah. and it builds with schools in Kenya, and and get these kids off the streets, and it's wonderful to have them support, yeah. help support us. Yeah, it's, it's really nice, and to you know, that's why we're here to like show our appreciation and say thank you. And with how you know everyone knows of Samsung, so for them to do all of this work for different charities, it's um, it's just an honor that they help us out and all these children and. So yeah, we're happy to be here, and we cannot thank you enough, Samsung. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. All right. So I need to ask you uh, because I I do do research on people's Twitter before I talk to them because that's the best thing to do. That's the best way Who to talk. Who cares about I am? Like, what, about, about what about Instagram? Instagram? Or like, what about Instagram though? No, I was gonna say oh, Instagram too. Well, Twitter okay. it's all freaking together. But you just did a video with Darren Chris, who I, I think is awesome, and we always see him at the Trevor Project, like yeah. every gal, every at any events. He's super um, wonderful. He's the sweetest. So yeah. tell us about the music video. Um, basically, he we had both known the band for a yeah. little bit separately oh. we didn't even know as friends that we knew them together because he knew him from here and I knew him from you know through another friend but um he called me and goes listen I'm gonna do this video I mentioned your name they want you to do it and it's basically about a relationship they're trying to make a relationship work in two different cities so especially with what I've done I've definitely had to have that experience with trying to make it work and you want to see them but you can't so um it touched home a little bit and I'm just a big fan of a great big world and um, when I saw the treatment and heard the song, I thought I have to be a part of this. And then to work with Darren Chris is, was awesome. He's way too multi talented. I, I was like, just gonna say that. <laughs> I and mean, sing, dance, play instruments. It was it was a teenage dream. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. I'll be here all night. No, only for five more minutes. We're almost done. Um, yeah. But. Do all the CW stars continue hanging out together? I feel like all the shows. Like, it's like always. Where's Jenny Humphreys? You know? <laughs> um, I mean, yeah, because a lot of times when you promote your yeah, shows yeah. on the same network, you end up like traveling overseas to do press and stuff like that. But yeah, I mean, yeah, we were at a music festival with Nina, who was on the CW Sweet. as well, and I still talk to some of the cast from Gossip Girl. And yeah, I mean, it, you kind of like become sort of a family because you get to know each other outside of your your own little world. Yeah, you know, you're traveling the world together, and yeah, yeah so we. Yeah, you still see the same people. On the <laughs> like, it's like a little club. So what else are you guys both up to that you want to share? Besides obviously being here, anything coming up? Um, just 
trying to make some fun summer travel plans and, yeah. you know. Yeah. And you have a movie coming up soon? I do. Um, it's called Two Night Stand with Miles Teller and Annalie Tipton and uh, Scott awesome. McCuddy, Kid Cuddy. Oh, yeah. Plays my really? boyfriend. We have some interesting scenes together, and it's awesome. But um, it's funny, and it's cute, and it was cool because I'd known Miles and Kid for a while. So it was, again, cool it to work with your friends. It was such a fun set Yeah, to be it's on. like when you find out, and you're the, like, the whole contract comes through, you're like, wait, I'm yeah. going to actually like, get to go to New York for the summer, do something I love with people that I love. So it was cool. The better part of that is the promotional cycle after that, because you know you're all going to be part, like, <laughs> hanging out the Traveling whole time. And just like, a yeah, good time. this will be Lots fun. Dinners. Like, Give me some wine. I can handle Maybe that. Maybe lots of wine. We're Maybe gonna lots. we're gonna do a selfie. Because, uh, we're gonna be tweeting both of you, and the uh, celeb with the most retweets gets five thousand dollars more to their charity. Oh, yeah. So get your friends involved. So, so get, get all your CW. Get, get, get Nina to retweet right, so it. We're gonna do it this way, and then we'll tweet it. All right, here, everyone, come in. I'm gonna go like That's this. That's the guy. There we go. Good. <laughs> All right, there you go. Yay. Thank you guys so Thank much. Thank you, girl. So nice to meet you. Have a wonderful yeah, evening. Have fun. Have fun. You look beautiful. Have fun. We'll see you inside. Bye. Bye. Nice to meet you. Have fun. Well, now we have this. Well, we can hold this, too. So much we going on. So much going well, on. How did you feel? I feel great. I feel excited. I feel like it was a wonderful evening. I it know. Was, it really we was. We saw, I would say, 85, 90% of the people I wanted to see. I'm excited because for this, a lot of times there's so many people and a lot of people go inside if they're performing or presenting because there is inside a whole show and everything, uh, but we actually got so many people who are a part of it, like high level people, and Martha Tony Stewart, Bennett, didn't Underwood, expect Martha everyone. Stewart, so I mean, I'm just like thrilled. I know. Do we have any tweets we can share, any we final have, well, thoughts? Well, we are, there is the tag board. Uh, we've been checking the tag board for your tweets using the hashtag. Do we have the phone, we can look at some of them and We just will say continue thank throughout you. the night, by the way, retweeting you, giving you shout outs. Yes. And uh, it, you probably have heard this if you've been watching. Uh, we are basically tweeting a ton of awesome selfies we did with the celebrities we spoke to on Instagram.com slash WT Live. It'll be really interesting to see how many of them yeah. get the most retweets. So Martha Stewart retweet, will probably whoever gets the most hopefully carry well. I'm gonna retweet Carrie. Wow. He's fascinating. I love He's I just like I imagined. Like him. Is that, oh, oh, you yeah. never met him, right? No, no, no. Alright, let's give some people a shout out. So we have I'm a videos Marat in my Cares. bedroom in Connecticut. I've never met anybody. Let's give some people shout outs before we end much. this. Um at Marat Cares, shout out to you. Alicia London, thank you so much for watching. At J Jackie H90. Uh, we have some more on Twitter we'll bring up right now. We have a ton of Carrie Underwood uh, fans that I know are watching. Oh, this is the wrong Hope for Children. We again. need hashtag Hope for number that. four children. And once again, we are Witch Training. We are a great supporter of Samsung, a media partner for the third year in a row uh, for this initiative, which helps bring children more healthy, sustainable lives. And so that's what it's all about, spreading the word of the hashtag of all the organizations you heard about tonight. And of course, all these videos are going to be up later on our channel. Thank as well you. William, thank you, Christina. Oh, wait, we need to get the all tweets. All tweets. Let's go to all tweets. I really want. All right, there you go. All right, so we have Christina. Yeah, purple uh, unicorns. Teresa says, "My hope for children is that they never allow haters or bullies to hold them back from their dreams. Stay strong and walk tall." Very thank nice. you, Teresa. That's beautiful. Um, yes, Carrie Underwood's fans were here. They were all talking about Carrie Underwood, Sean Avery, All American Girl, Sarah Hughes, What's Trending. <laughs> um, Anna Sophia Robb, who was here earlier, tweeted, Mine would be to change mine. Be the change you wish to see in the world. That's, That's lovely. Nice. I like that. Anna. Um, Donna Wasson. Hi, Donna. Says, My hope is that someday all children live without fear and know they are safe and loved. That's, That's beautiful. Nice. We had someone also talk about that, like not being scared, staying yeah. safe. Uh, we, oh, we a lot of Carrie Underwood fans. And I think that's a wrap. I think yeah. we have to go. We're, we're going to be checking tw Twitter, though, throughout the night. So tweet us at my, at, well, at Buck Hollywood. I'm Buck Hollywood. Nice to meet you. Michael Buckley, you've been wonderful. I had a great time. I don't know what I would have done without you tonight. It would have been fun. My existence is now better. Thank you, Cheryl Lazar. is better, and this whole blue carpet is better because Hoda Kotb thinks I'm the reason for the Emmy. That's uh, that's going on my highlight reel. <laughs> you should, yeah, you <laughs> that's should. the reason you got an Emmy. I'm like, I just got you. <laughs> uh, we also want to, of course, thank Samsung, Hope for Children, the entire initiative for, you know, powering this entire live stream and the reason we're all here tonight. Thanks to all of you for watching. And, and spreading the love, spreading the message. This live stream will be on youtube.com slash what's trending from now until eternity. So definitely continue sharing uh, the message. I'm Cheryl Lazar. Subscribe and we'll see you soon. Thank you. Bye guys. Bye. Good job. Uh -huh. uh